Here we go again. Hello, Jack. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. With less fucking about. Probably. Sonic. I'm gonna. Sonic. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna make an effort. Sonk. 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 Sonk O six. Stonk O six. Stonks O six is Sonic, except he's doing stocks. I mean, this probably was stonk <laughs> significant for Sega. Uh, Saucy, you're a bit quiet. Uh, can you like get close to your mic or anything? I'm um I, all right. Let me plug in my earbuds. How does this work? Cool. So last time we got through a small portion of Sonic story and an even smaller portion of Silver story. Yeah, we lost some progress on Sonic, which I had to make up off stream. It wasn't as bad as I thought, as far back as we were. Yeah. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah. The alternative would have been really bad. Well, we would have spent like an extra 30 minutes catching up on Sonic again. Oh, wow, this yeah. is not going to come out. Got something, Jack? Yes. I, uh,. I found out that at the uh, at the thriftway they are selling uh, they are selling a, a bottle of, of mead. I've never had mead, so I'm gonna try it. Oh, okay. Oh, that's how you do it. All right. <laughs> ah. Oh, what? Oh, That's the it. intro again. Oh. Oh, I guess it is, yeah. <laughs> yes, there we go. The mead has been uncorked. <laughs> I am ready. I am now ready to play Sonic Ghost, or watch Zelrog play Sonic 06. <laughs> I'm hearing a lot of, uh, is that me? Is that my oh, mic? Feels... <laughs> what is what are you doing? Uh, all right. That is what? What do you, what do you got? What do you got, Zellrog? Yeah, I think, th I think that's my microphone. It's just got a, I got a very loud buzzing sound. Oh well, I guess that's just the case with room mode. Alright, back at it. Hello, Darian. I'm noticing, I'm noticing that the, that the uh, background audio is fading out whenever you're not talking. For the, like, the game audio and everything? Yeah. yeah. So, you know that's so good. It did that want... last time, but I didn't want to say anything. Okay. <laughs> that's well, fine. Yeah, that's because the game audio is coming through the microphone. They don't really have a good way to do it otherwise. Unfortunately. I don't know why it's... I have, like, my compressor and everything off, though, so I don't know what, why it would be doing that. Oh. So what's, uh... Beam! What level? Sonic Beam. Heroes! <laughs> Okay, we're going to White Acropolis. Oh yeah, that's right. You uh, you fucked up at this level because uh, because the snowboarding kicked your ass. The snowboarding did in fact kick my ass. Because because the snowboard mechanics are bullshit. They are kind of because, bad. Yes. Oh, <laughs> you can say that. You can say that about literally everything in Sonic 06, and and I believe you. Gotta go Jeez. slow. Yeah! Yeah. Top speeds! No, it's okay, we gotta be careful. This is like, it's like watching like a pro wrestler, right? And oh, they're, they're snowboarding they're still robots. Doing their, 
they're daredevil style, except for some reason they're on a bunch of drugs, and so they're not, they're sloppier at it. It's like, <laughs> it's like a late WCW, uh, like, uh, luchador. Is that what happens? Um, Slow motion boxing. Or rather, like, late, late stage career Sabu, if you, if you know who that is. Colombian not, that's fine. luchador. He's still trying to do all his, like, moves where he's jumping off of chairs and onto ropes and then doing flips, and he's just sloppy at it. I this did sounds the same like exact... Tony Hawk's. Oh, you did that thing again. The <laughs> exact same place as last time. I keep thinking that's the way to go, and it's a fucking cliff. It's fine. There's been a week. Don't worry about it. No. <laughs> this is this is why you need to save every single time you exit a level or at that time everything happens, because assume every level is going to wipe out all your lives, and then that's how. That's how you could get outside of 6. I forget this is the PS3 era before autosave. Uh, <laughs> autosave, that was on like no PS3 games. It certainly wasn't on every other fucking one but this one. Yeah, you remember how there were like, there were like games. Uh, there are games nowadays where it's like, hey, if this icon is going, you idiots don't exit out because it's saving. Well, yeah, that's every game <laughs> nowadays. Have, you don't have to worry about that now. Ooh. Speaking of Sonic, I uh, I got Adventure DX on Steam the other day. Oh yeah, and, uh, yeah. Uh, I speed ran through it so much that I was constantly mashing the, the start button to skip cutscenes because I was like, no, I want I want to get to the final boss. And yeah. I don't remember the final boss being that bullshit on the Dreamcast version. The <laughs> oh, perfect I, chaos. Oh, yeah. Sometimes I just breeze through them, and sometimes he causes some trouble. It's very... Like, in Phase 2, it's particularly bad. If you get hit once, you're fucked. You might as well just kill yourself. Like, yeah. <laughs> there's no point. You okay, can't so you only lost one back. life there. Cool. I have that with the, the, the final it's hazard, too, though. Like, usually I breeze through it, but then... Like, if you don't do it just right the first time, you hit a block, and then it just starts to get worse and worse, and you, you fuck up and die. Yeah. <laughs> that seems to be Sonic. Just the Sonic game just telling you, no, you displeased me. You're not going through here today. <laughs> also, just... the weird, also a weird thing that I don't remember uh, was that uh, if you fail the boss even once and you start over, to call chimes in with a, hey, if you get to top speed, you'll turn into a bolt of lightning. And only then can you attack him. And I'm like, wait, that's what's happening? <laughs> I didn't know I that either. I was just flying inside of him. What do you mean I turn into lightning? I mean, that, ma that makes more sense, to be honest. You know, lightning against water, but... It was always weird paid... throughout the entirety of Sonic Adventure that the solution to a water monster was just whacking it. Yeah, and then yeah. I paid more attention to it after I heard that. I was like, oh, he's glowing, really, with, like, yellow light. I'm like, oh... He is turning into lightning. What he's, is that? He's a Super Saiyan, though. That's just what Wait they do. Do those <laughs> lasers? Do those lasers not hurt you? They just block you. Yeah, they're just. <laughs> oh, wait. No, these ones hurt me. Oh, uh, those. <laughs> Hold on. Those, those lasers. Those lasers don't have damage. You coated oh. them. Oh, never mind. Okay, you were just lucky for some reason. <laughs> okay. Are you saying? Are guy. you suggesting that this game might be inconsistent in some way? <laughs> No, never. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's fine. The guards who are manning that forgot to turn on like the the, the stun setting on the on the uh, laser fence. So it was, why was it just blocking? See, they have to have that after Gun got uh, got like sued. Oh boy. Sorry. No, you can't have actual lasers. Just just have a, a holographic see through wall. <laughs> yeah, it's hard light. <laughs> the shit they use uh, on the Halo. <laughs> Hard light, yeah, it's a thing. It's a that's what they used in uh, Halo. That's the bridge technology and shit. And oh. then, uh, and then uh, you know, Green Lanterns they weaponize hard light. Uh, you're supposed to kill them. I, I have no watching? idea. It says there's a switch somewhere. Oh, well, good luck finding it. I, I couldn't even find any rings. Maybe it's at the top of the snowboarding section. I'll just go back. Hey, cool rings. 
Gotta go. Gotta backtrack. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's on top of the watchtower. God, can you imagine a Sonic game with heavy backtracking? I guess if the world was big enough. Oh. If it was a huge open world thing. You know what they need to do? Burnout Paradise Sonic Edition. Wait. Break the ice. Yeah. There you go. I, I, I've, I've been wanting a Breath of the Wild Sonic. They did They did a proof of concept version of that for that uh, DLC for, uh, what was it? Sonic, uh, Sonic Worlds? What, Sonic it was Worlds? Just, oh no. Lost World? Oh, you yeah, mean Sonic a fan Lost game? World. No, it wasn't a fan game. It was DLC for uh, for for uh, Legend of Zelda, or no, for Sonic Lost World, which was uh, which was uh, Sonic in a Zelda costume, and you were running around uh, high oh. field. No, it was fun. It looked fun. I mean, why am I yeah, playing as Tails? Sonic is here because because Tails because... insisted that he would take it from there, and then so it's so like, okay, little buddy. I'll, I'll let you do your thing, I guess. I could get through here in like two seconds, but... Yeah, because cause he, cause he, cause he has to fly, and so I, he can't fly. Oh, holy fly shit, Tails goes, accelerates in the air fast. Yeah, he's a mad, he's like... Sonic in an airplane couldn't outspeed Tails in the air, are you kidding me? <laughs> Wait, I can throw <laughs> fake rings in the air? Yeah, you can, you can fire them off. Yeah, and there's no way to tell what's what's a real ring and what's not. <laughs> yeah, because because this cause this mechanic, I don't know if you if you uh, if you realize this or not, but it was poorly thought out. <laughs> like, hey, I I think they reincorporated it from like. You know how like flying characters from Sonic Heroes, if there's nobody, like if all your other teammates are dead, you have to have an attack. So they're like, oh, let's have them throw fake rings. Just is that what they have, did? Just have I think tails, so. Just have I remember tails, that happening. Just, you know, Tails, you could just like throw bombs. He's a yeah. gadgeteer. That wouldn't be like out of like. Doesn't Rouge no, do that? Fake... I don't think she did. In, in Sonic Heroes? Bombs? No, she just. No, she just, she just punched stuff. Yeah. She, but uh, she... I remember playing Sonic Heroes as a kid, and I remember uh, at least once uh, all my all the the Knuckles and Sonic were dead or like captured or something, and I tried to do something as Tails, and he started throwing a, like a bucket of rings everywhere. I'm like, oh. what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> there's there's a ravine there. Okay. Uh. So that was a mechanic from Heroes that they reincorporated here. I, I never knew that was a thing. Uh, Darian, how are the how, how are the levels? Is the game okay compared to us, them and me and everything? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. We're on YouTube as well as, uh, as Twitch. We are. We're basically giving Twitch the middle finger of a finger because they didn't do shit for us. And these stupid <laughs> console games with multiple people are the hardest to get all the audio settings just right for. Yeah, because of the way this is being done. There's no real good way to do this. To All do because of the game. stupid Elgato delay. Yeah. Yeah, that's, uh... Oh, we need... There's gotta be a better... A better, uh, capture card system. Fuck if I know how to do it, though. Yeah, I should, I should really look into that one of these days. That's what? But another capture card that's not Elgato. <laughs> So, I am assuming that Shadows and Silver stories are at least a little shorter than Sonic's. Is that the case, Saucy? Actually, no. It's the other way around. Oh, I remember okay. Sonic's being way shorter, actually. Yeah, because Sonic moves faster. He's like, he's yeah, like Sonic, this. Sonic has way less going for him in his campaign than uh, Shadow and Silver have, actually. I think Which is very strange, because this is his fucking game. Well, like, no, because it was originally going to be Silver's game, and then Sonic was like, Hey, I'm here too. Oh yeah, I, I forgot about that. <laughs> what, a, what a move that would have been. to, Like, Sonic already has so many characters in the franchise. You have a whole yeah. new game about a whole new untested character. Just fucking make a game called Mobius and have play, and have it be an open world game where you, or you could play as, like... Like the Elder Scrolls, except for have, except for Mobians and Sonic characters, and have have microtransaction character skins. 
<laughs> I, you got, like, you got, how many hundreds of Sonic characters have you got? You might as well. Yeah. yeah. They're actually, I heard that they're act, that uh, Sega is actually trying to move away from, like, the term Mobius and that kind of, like, thing and just have them be, oh, they're, uh, they're animal critters, and I'm like, you don't want you want to get rid of their national identity. Well, it was only Why? called Mobius in the comics. Why? Right. The comics are arguably yeah. the the best thing. <laughs> well, it's they either just... that or Sonic X, and uh, I'm well, not because like they did. They keep saying that like no, nothing in the comics is canon. That's not canon. That never will be. And I'm like, why not? It's good. <laughs> you might. It's good. It's, it's... Except <laughs> for the thirty years later arc, but we don't talk about that one. The 30 years later arc in the in the arc that posits that Charmy acts the way he does because of brain damage. Hey, it's a <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember that. I remember reading that. Where is that face? I love this Eggman. He he looks. Oh yeah. He looks. This is the cutscene where he see, where we see his eyeball. <laughs> he's got that. Uh, he's got that Leo nose. <laughs> Let me see the chaos world. Here it is. Place it there. I wouldn't. Tr like, what's he gonna do to release? Is he gonna like fucking choke slam her or something? Why not? <laughs> Sonic is so willing to work with the uh, hostage Ew. situations in the games. Like the first episode of Sonic X, Eggman has the trigger button, and Sonic's like, "Yeah, try to press it. I dare you." Do it, so, man. <laughs> So who do you think would win in a in a in like a battle of, of like minds, uh, Bowser or Eggman? Eggman. Like who? I mean, Eggman. Bowser's you think Bowser's idiot. smart? <laughs> you think, like, man, Bowser Bowser would go all Sonic on Eggman if Eggman tried to fuck with him. So a better Bowser question. is like Bowser is rich and has charisma. He has like Koopa scientists that do shit for him. Dude's, dude's the fucking best dad in the world. Of all the villain dads, he's like the best villain dad. At least in canon. We we just yeah. we need to wait for Eggman's daughter to appear in canon. Oh, that'd be great. We need omelet. I wish. Yeah, I wish they would make her canon. They've been teleported. Oh, this is not canon, time. and it never will be. No. Fuck you. <laughs> this is canon. At least cameo in the IDW comic. The distant past, or I sent them to, the, to another time frame. What he, time frame? I don't know. He gave up on killing them and just I teleported sent, them somewhere. I sent them to the plot of the Sonic the Hedgehog movie. No, you bastard! Can we talk That's about? Too far. Can we talk about how groin emphasizing his outfit in this game is? By the way, he's trying. He's trying to impress the princess. A little bit. <laughs> It's like those Japanese maid outfits that emphasize the bust, but for guys. You will be my gamer girl queen. Yeah, I see that. Twitch Prime yeah. will be mine. She looks yeah. so dead. Twitch Prime. He does just. He's just. A lot of this, these scenes between him and Elise are him just like monologuing in front of Elise while Elise is like unconcerned. It's just like, what? What are you gonna do, huh? You're not gonna kill me. You couldn't like, even kill Sonic. Can't kill anybody, Eggman. Wait a minute, you broke into my room and you just replaced my shoes with slowdown shoes? <laughs> well, I never actually wanted to kill you. He's a, he doesn't <laughs> want to kill anybody, he just he just wants what he wants, but he doesn't have like the, uh, he's not that evil, he doesn't want to kill anybody, he just wants what he wants. He's not, I, don't, I would say he's not even like a so socio or a psychopath, he's just... Hey, uh, he's <laughs> hey Knuckles, are you okay? Look who's here. You I fell on your head. You guys. No, he's fine. He doesn't need it. <laughs> what? Hey. She, she got, like, even more sultry since the last game. Hey, are you? Oh, are I we hate... allies or enemies here? Oh, I think this is I the Sonic this X actress. cast. This is... I think this is the replacement My Valentine actress. I hate oh. this actress. She's so bad. Yeah. Man, Station Square is like... better days. Like, people are like, no, it's only this game. I'm like, no, she's garbage in every Sonic thing she's ever been in. I hate her voice. It's so awful. Then that means Eggman's machine can control time. Eggman's machine can control time. Eggman's got some nerve dropping us here. Now, how can we get back to our own time? You need a space time rift. Akira Toriyama is watching this and scribbling down notes for Dragon Ball Super. 
<laughs> no, it's fine. Just give Boot a shout. It's Mobius in the old cartoon, too. Yes, the adventure... Not adventures. Uh, Saturday Morning Sonic was based off of the Archie comics. I just like that it's a name. That we have a name for the world that's not Sonic's world. Yeah, Sonic's world is like what does Sonic own the world? Is he mayor? Is he is he lord of? Like, we have Earth. Just... Call it something. It's like, hey Sonic, where are you from? He's like, I don't know. It's my world. <laughs> this, that's what the song his world is about. <laughs> uh, Earth two. <laughs> like, call it. Eggman is attacking Sonic. Wait, my son, the planet, or me? <laughs> the planet Sonic. Yes! <laughs> when, his dad, when his dad, Sonic first, like, founded the planet for all the other uh -oh. Sonicites. Nope. Nah. <laughs> oh, oh god, this is the level I hate the most. Oh, I, oh no. I haven't saved. You didn't have a chance to save, did you? Oh, we got no. two boarding levels in a row. Did you, or did it offer you a chance to save? I don't you, think so. Level? Oh no, I, maybe, I don't remember. Shit, if you die here, then you gotta go back to back oh, to the no, snow level. Oh <laughs> no, no, I'll cry, no. Have I mentioned that the jumping is inconsistent as shit? I, I, yeah. I, you don't have to tell me, I could just assume. <laughs> All's well that ends well! Yeah. That's fine, you would've made it. You're what? being attacked by uh, phoenixes. There's Moltres here. And, and those things from Jabu Jabu's belly, except they're on fire. <laughs> I don't know how to grind, so I'm just skipping every rail. Just get to the end. You don't need. You don't need all the. Oh, no. what do you get? All the. Metal oh, metal. mistake. Tony you Hawk, this is not. That. This game's dumb. This is like, no, you wouldn't have survived that. You totally would. Thank you, the Sonic. Whole, the whole city's on fire. I like how his his like get hit by that stuff is the uh, Roblox oof as well. Oof. That's not the Roblox oop, that's the Messiah oop. We've been over this. You remember... Messiah, Messiah. did it first. Man, you're cutting out a lot. Oh, I am. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I don't need to hear Sonic tell me the fucking obvious like 33 times in a row. Uh, so Jack, have you looked into or gotten the chance to play the new Pac-Man game yet? I haven't. Uh, I haven't seen. I, but I noticed you have played it. Is it? I've seen how it's played. It seems interesting. Yeah. Uh, what do you What do you think of it? Uh, like Mario 35, it didn't. I don't think it's going to maintain my interest too much. But oh. it's not bad. It was fun for a little bit. Wait, there was a bunch of launch pads, and it just and it just ended the level no. before you hit them. No, you're not allowed to use them. No. Maybe it has to load <laughs> the other half of the level. Maybe you would have hit it and you would have gotten off the board and it would have been dynamic, but they're like, no, we gotta load this shit again. I would love if someone, if they updated this game like 10 years later and it's on the title screen and it just has a sign that says no fun allowed. <laughs> what? <laughs> Excuse me? Bye! Bye. Okay, I'm not gonna press anything this time. I was like holding forward. There we go. <laughs> okay, this doesn't have the Sonic Adventure rail jumping. Beautiful. <laughs> this, this game perfect in every way. Ten out of ten. Seven out of ten. <laughs> seven, seven and a half. Oh, that yeah. ends. Oh, 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 oh! How is this worse than the snowboarding section? Boy, I would love a chance to save. No, you nope. can only start over no. and quit. Okay, I'm on my last life. I gotta be so careful. Oh, that is. Like, yep. Yeah, and you've got a mock speed section <laughs> coming. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that's fine. You get to cool off back in the snow. This is a PS3 game! Why does it still have lives?! <laughs> I'm dying! I love this. <laughs> this is so bad! Skip.
shit! Okay, good, oh, good. Oh, okay, thank God. <laughs> We're saved. We're saved. <laughs> what? Sonic? You made it back to the like, present? Just have to skip, like, three cutscenes, that's all. <laughs> 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 this game is... <laughs> it makes me so anxious that I start screaming even though I'm not playing. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Let's appreciate the good game design of including an autosave there, though. Autosave? Hey, it no, won't always be there okay, to save okay. you. <laughs> I figured it out. The reason why the, there's no autosave is because they have to do all this fucking loading. Yeah. That would mean being more loading. They oh, couldn't get no. it to work because... Because of how the game loads, it has to load the map every time it loads something new. So yeah. as, as a result, they couldn't get the autosave working because they had to have loading screens every like five minutes. I've cracked the code. I've cracked it. Oh, oh boy. I like how, the, how those cars were like jostling each other. Right. Didn't? <laughs> okay. I, I, rem I remember, I think we started, like, Silver Story at some point, right? We yeah, did. We did, like, one or didn't, two. Didn't he say that there's, like... Like, he says that there, like, are people here, but, like, the whole city is just fucking in ruins. Yeah. So, like, why like are there taxi like... cars here 200 years in the future? I, why do know. we still have taxis? I guess it's they're like... still there from before the time. Where am I... That reminds me of, uh, of like, in Battlefield Earth, it's supposed to take place in the year 3000, like, set, like, hundreds upon hundreds of years after aliens came and took over Earth, and there's yeah. still, like, cities and, like, fucking mini-golf, like, ornaments everywhere, and, oh, and, okay. and this movie reviewer is like, okay, I can't take this fucking movie seriously if in the year <laughs> 3000 all this shit's still here. <laughs> no way. There's oh, no Sonic. way by the year 3000 we haven't realized that golf is meaningless. Yeah, and uh, not golf? to mention the fact that uh, apparently uh, these aliens and all their advanced technology beat, beat the entire forces of Earth in nine minutes. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, fucking Combine, they're like multi-universal conquerors, and, they, and it took them six fucking hours to... <laughs> Like, like, what is this, a fucking anime? Like, Nine <laughs> we don't beat the villain in ten minutes? Uh, other way around, they conquered Earth in nine minutes, is what Jack said, right? <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. Oh, okay. uh, I was just I was just thinking, like, okay, so the Combine... Hello, Sonic from, Faster, from hello, Fawn Elephant. The Combine from Half-Life beat, like, took over the entirety of Earth in six hours. That's why they call it the six-hour war, right? And then uh -huh. these fucking cyclos from Battlefield Earth, apparently, they sped, sped run the conquering of Earth in nine minutes. Ergo, oh the cyclos could totally take on the fucking... <laughs> oh my god. The frame rate. Nine minutes. Nine Come minutes. on. That's just ridiculous. Like, six hours? I could buy that. Nine minutes. How long do you think it would take for Cell to, like, break the hope of the, of, of the people? Because they were, like, sending tanks and shit to the Cell games in all their futility. That would have probably done it, actually, so... If like, just... unless they're the, the gods from Ruby who just have a, a delete human button on hand, I don't think so. Oh, there's <laughs> gods oh, in Saitama? Ruby now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Saitama delete human <laughs> punch. <laughs> One keystroke, like, man. Like, there's a scene in the show, Ruby, where, like, like these gods that used to rule the planet... These gods used to rule the planet, and one of them literally just, like, cr like he balls his hand into a fist, and then a ray shoots out all across Earth, and humans are all gone. I mean, and, like, Majin Buu does And that. I'm like, what the fuck? Majin Buu does that, but it takes it a little longer than a second, at least. And he does miss, like, three of them. Like, there's, like... It takes, like, probably, like, three minutes, but, like, all of humanity is wiped down one fell swoop. And I'm like, what? How? How did you do this? So that's the end of the series, right? If all of humanity is gone, that means that the series no, it's is a, over. No, it's a, it's a flashback thing. Oh. It's like, oh, oh, this is before, you know, how humanity is right now. 
and they just repeated humanity somehow. They don't explain how. Somehow. They don't well, explain how humans come back. By the way, they don't explain that. Never. Well, he missed some, and they <laughs> they bred. That's how. That's how it usually works. <laughs> like this is why. This is why you don't. You don't like exterm. Like poor. Like, Even though. Bleach. Even though he explicitly told this immortal human that they cursed, you're all that left. You're all that's left of humanity. Like well, no. <laughs> well, he cloned himself. Well, he had an opposite sex clone of himself when he. <laughs> oh, the Boo method. <laughs> and, and I'm just hearing just... a lot of shit about Majin Boo. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's how Majin Boo was created. So oh, we're now in so some kind of <laughs> we're in some kind of wind tunnel. Why did we suddenly transport to the ending of Sly Cooper 2? Okay, this isn't a mock <laughs> speed section. Not yet, but it'll get there. <laughs> Just you wait. Hell is coming. Piccolo took over the world. <laughs> you mean Piccolo the Super Saiyan? Yes. No, Piccolo the Yoshi. <laughs> Piccolo took over the world. He, he also... He could have killed a lot more people than me than killing. Well, he had, he had, like, a plan in place of systematically wiping out countries using a drawing system. Oh, yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna fucking Hunger Games that shit. Or rather, I, I should have had a timer shit. going. I didn't keep track of how long it took him. You know what? Somebody's like, somebody's like, what'd you think of Hunger, Hunger Games? And I go, I liked it better when it was called Battle Royale. Yeah, I don't like it when the platforms <laughs> move like that. That's not. That's not wobble. This reminds me of uh, Shadow the Hedgehog. There were like end game levels similar to this. I'm literally all I'm thinking of is like the last section of this of Sly Cooper Two, where you have to it. like tr rem maneuver across a bunch of floating objects that are way too far away from each other. Well, yeah, that's like that's the clock flight. The flight I thought that right? was I thought that was slide yeah, one. The the stupid oh, that, was... that makes no sense. I guess that was, was so fucking short. <laughs> all things considered. Alright, mock speed. Now, can we get to a point where I can go to the menu and save? No, this is, this is all one level. This we is Crisis to, City. We have to find the computer database. I hate you, Cooper Gang, even though I don't really even know you. <laughs> mock speed. Thank you, Sonic. It, very good, it is! <laughs> Very good. <laughs> if, 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 I, I would, I would just like to say it's carrying more than one car, Sonic. Um, Let him have this. That... Boy, that sure is interesting. But I sure don't care. It sure <laughs> is, probably... Charmy. It sure is. <laughs> oh no! Uh, never jump to the left or right. Never <laughs> jump. Never jump. Anything. Never hold forward. <laughs> nope. Okay, don't bye. You don't need to hold anything, Zorog. He's just constantly moving forward. You don't need to hold forward at any point because he's he's going forward. It's just it's been the most alive living in the gangster's paradise. Uh, uh, Is that used in the movie or just the trailer? Uh, that was just the trailer. Then they have you made seen it, the movie? Replaced it with something better. Have you seen the movie, Jack? I have not. Well, how do you? How heard the fuck about, do heard you know? Right. Out. I heard. I actually heard that from the casual movie-going audience that eh, it was all right. Of course, the casual thing. It's pretty good. It's not faithful to like any game or whatever, but I don't. I don't think it needed to be. It just needed to be, you know, not garbage. I will say that uh, that uh, neither was the Mario Brothers movie, and I will say that yeah, that yeah. movie that was also all right. So this is full Belmont. Once you jump, you were going straight in that direction for like 500 feet. Yes. So basically, yeah. If you ever um, jump, you need to reposition yourself straight forward, or you're gonna be fucked. You have to do it before yeah. you jump. Yeah. Always jump yeah. forward. Don't ever jump at an angle, or you're completely uh... fucked. <laughs> Ideally, you don't want. To, you wouldn't want to jump at all. Um... <laughs> Except that the game makes you. Jack, yeah. I don't know if you're aware, but the tornado is carrying a car. That tornado's carrying a Did car. Did you know that the city is on fire? This whole wow. city's on fire. That tornado's <laughs> carrying a car. Water's wet. Lava's hot. 
Trucks are weird. It's weird because it's because it's not even like an attitude thing. It's just Sonic stating the fucking obvious. Like, you know what would be a Sonic thing to say? Oh wow, I don't want to get smoked by that lava. <laughs> okay, it's a little corny for Sonic, but it's more on the Flying. right track. Flying cars. This really is the future. <laughs> so something like that. That's oh yeah, now better. this place is happening. <laughs> Uh oh. Ah! <laughs> Holy shit, am I in Detroit? Silver, what am I gonna do with you? <laughs> yeah, because that's, that's a Sonic thing to say, not like this, like, fucking... Yeah, this, this is Detroit after the events of Detroit become human. <laughs> Imagine if Sonic just starts saying, like, shit about mathematical algorithms for no reason. <laughs> oh wow, no, that's Metal Sonic. <laughs> Dude, that would've been a- You know what would be a great Metal Sonic characterization? Metal Sonic is what? just Sonic, except he's- He has a nerdier sense of, uh, attitude and humor. Oh, All of yes. his jokes are about computers. <laughs> Wait, what happened? I- I lost rings and then I instantly died. It recorded two hits. Yeah, he got- he Get got. good. <laughs> that creature had trample. Got that. that was a Magic the Gathering joke. I'm playing Magic again. It's been pretty, pretty fun. Uh, can't wait for the Harry Potter stuff to come out. Is that a real it's thing? It's not literally Harry. No, it's not literally Harry Potter. It's just the setting is. Oh, you're dead. Jumped in register. You can always go to Silver as one and then come back to this if this is giving you trouble. Yeah. That's the great thing about this game is that it knows whenever. Uh, Whenever this game seems to know on some level that certain levels are bullshit, see like that. Silver does have that ball puzzle at one point, though. Which, uh, uh, you people are people are like, it's so hard that you have to glitch through the door to get through it because it's just too much. It's easier to glitch through the door than to do the fucking puzzle. Oh, like the cafe yeah. side quest in Majora. I don't even remember what Shadow stuff is. Don't Shadows. spoil it. Don't spoil it. I don't, I don't, be, I don't, I don't I'm be, expecting mon guns and motorcycles. I will be disappointed by anything else. I won't. I won't say the contents. I'll just say I don't remember it being too hard at any point. But a, I might not be remembering correctly at all. <laughs> as opposed to Sonic Adventure 2 and Heroes, where the Shadow mode was supposed to be the hardest. Not to mention the fact that. Uh, Wait, what yeah, if, every, uh, it's what if okay, we... it's consistent. You just so fucking if, die. If you ever if you ever hit that thing even once, you're just dead. <laughs> yeah, it has death touch. Avoid the flaming maw. Good to know. <laughs> the, the giant uh fire worm has has corona. Oh no, so that worm is on die. fire. <laughs> game nonsense, man. <laughs> <laughs> this is the kind of I, tank I enjoy, where it's just like... Really? I thought it made perfect sense up to this point, honestly. <laughs> I'm, I'm like looking at this and I'm like, man, this is kind of... This, this, this has the that fan game energy. This could have been a fan this, game. This this would have been actually an impressive for a fan game. This would have been impressive for a fan game. You know what this is? <laughs> this is the room. Yeah. This is like someone <laughs> yeah, who doesn't yeah. know how to make a movie slash game with a lot of budget. But somebody <laughs> did know. It was Sega. They they made good games Ooh. before. Ooh, that was a clean. Oh. <laughs> what just happened? Oh well, I made it's it. Like, it's like if Spielberg. Right off of making Gen Schindler's list, made the room. Okay, okay, let's <laughs> settle down. You're, you're calling Sega Spielberg, Jack. Let's settle okay. down there. <laughs> okay, it's like if somebody who made uh, Fast and the Furious suddenly made the room. Who, who's a director who made one good movie and then never anything good again? Uh, Josh Trank. What, what did he do? Uh, he did. Uh, he did Chronicle. And then he did that uh, fan four stick, uh, a bomb. Fan four stick. 
Yeah, that's the Fantastic Four movie that everybody was like, why the fuck did they make this? Oh, oh right, they, because they were going to lose the rights. Thank you again, Sonic. Good memory. So, uh... So, I got, I got a good question for you. Is this the worst level you've played so far? I, I don't fucking know. They all blend together. This, I would say that, th that this would have been the worst level. Because the first level... That, that was kind of, kind of tricky, especially if you did the mock speed stuff without realizing that you had to save. And then when you were like, oh god, I gotta go back and do all this shit again. I didn't mind as long as I had save points. Now I don't. Yeah, this game does not want, want you to save at all. And it's like, this, this level is actually... This level, I think, is longer than any of the other Sonic levels so far. It looks nice. Uh, I was gonna say, so so many more and more things anymore. They're just going to the Funimation actors because they're cheap. You might as well just cut out the middleman and make sure make Goku Sean Sonic. Just make him Sean Schemmel. Oh man, I can't picture Sean Schemmel doing the Sonic voice though. You re really, you can't. I think it'd be fitting. Chris Sabat the uh, Shadow would be a little harder of a sell. Okay. Mas I, I would have gone with actually. You know who would have gone with for Sonic if you wanted to go that route? Who? Masako X. Okay. I would have yeah. gotten the. Uh, I would have gotten uh, like a, a bridged. Uh, Why did I do that? Goku. Okay, what? I'm good. I, I jumped and I shouldn't have. Damn. Are there's any number of more modern shonen protagonist voices like uh, the Aaron Yeager, Bryce Pappenbrook guy? But... This is, this is something I wanted to talk about. Is that uh, is that I want to see Shonen Hero voices uh, be, have more variety. Yeah, they're all very samey these days. I'm so like, tired of Bryce. I don't want to hear his voice anymore. You know what would have been? A, you know what would have was a good uh, was a good voice uh, like for a Shonen protagonist, uh, fucking Jotaro. Yeah. Just oh yeah. He, so he, he has he to was, sound like a deep ass yeah. man. No, you know what else would, would be great for a Shonen protagonist? Yeah. Any female, any 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 woman. <laughs> well, they okay. don't have woman? like women Shonen heroes. It'd be great. They like yeah. Oh, you mean like, as the character, this? not the actress. <laughs> what is this woman you speak of? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Somebody like Cora. Cora was cool. Cora was awesome. Uh oh! Oh no! <laughs> this spring isn't on fire! My suffering will be eternal! Oh no! No no no! Oh, I can't believe it! Was that? I've never seen that before. We, I think we broke in new ground. Yeah! Hey, hey Zelrog, you discovered a new Sonic 06 glitch. Congratulations. Oh boy, me and every other person who plays this game. Amazing! <laughs> Fucking brilliant. Somebody click that. That's great. Oh, I just please. ran up the wall. I don't care. <laughs> Alright, now remember, when you get to the mock speed section, oh, don't right. jump there at it. Oh, you God, say man. that, you make it sound so easy, Jack. Anyways, um, I was, before that, I was about to say, um, I've been working on an anime project with my dad that we plan to have like animation for and all that. Oh, and yeah? I realized, like, two weeks into designing characters, I have a lot of women and almost no men. <laughs> yeah. Mm. And it's it takes place in a school. Like, I've designed 90% women and, like, 5% men. <laughs> so like, it's, there's no so dudes. So it's My Little Pony school. <laughs> I guess so. Equestria girls. It's Equestria Sailor Moon. Girl. It's most female focused okay. series. I wish there was more cosplay of the outfits they wear in that show, because I would wear a lot of that stuff. And Equestria Girls? Like their swimsuits look really good. I want to wear those. Oof! <laughs> you tripped, you, you tripped I hold forward! Like Why did I hold forward?! Why?! <laughs> Why? 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 They don't usually let you control the cutscene parts! In other older Sonic games. 
don't need to hold forward oh during this God. section literally at all. You know what? You know what my favorite, like, weird thing to control in a video game that I kind of hate love is? What? Is when they let you fuck around with the camera at any point whenever you want. Yeah. Like, there was some kind of, uh, game uh, that was some kind of prequel to Street Fighter or whatever, and I was allowed to just move the camera and zoom it in during cutscenes. For no reason. Uh, oh, and I was you know like, what? Would have been cool yeah. if, if- It would have been cool if you were able to do that in, like, in, in like- I, Did they allow you to do that in Metal Gear games? I don't remember. I, I like remember it was a thing that- I think I oh, heard no. that you could, uh- like spin Batman oh, during the opening cutscenes of Arkham Asylum. Yeah, I kind of I have a hate love relationship with that kind of control because I'm like it's funny, but also why do you let me do this? <laughs> it's a cutscene. Why am I allowed to ruin the moment? <laughs> oh yeah, you can do that in some Metal Gear games. I think Revengeance lets you do that. Oh yeah, Revengeance does let you do that sometimes. <laughs> Is it Revengeance or am I thinking of Metal Gear Five? I don't remember now. Both. Both. You could control, like, I remember one cutscene where uh, Otacon had just invented a little uh, scout robot, and you could control the robot and move around the room with its camera while he was talking. Oh, yeah, that, that, that's, I think that's four, actually. Because five didn't have Otacon. Five had that bastard Huey Emberg. Oh, yeah. By the way, Huey Emberg. Total bastard. Fuck yeah. Forever. And this section is- <laughs> oh, no! oh! Oh, okay, you picked up an extra life, it's so fine. Okay, thank god. <laughs> what a gotta get these wrong. rings. Uh, happened? it reversed my controls when the camera changed. It and I was, like, reversed. mentally a second behind. What the fuck? I hate that. <laughs> Think if fast. you're gonna change the camera, don't reverse the controls. But you have to see the giant thing that's chasing Sonic in every Sonic game. Every Sonic game needs one. Give me rings. Rings! You already- Sonic Adventure has at least three times where that happens. There's the orca, there's like two instances of rocks chasing you. This happened in this game, you don't need it multiple times, you don't- Oh yeah! It did have the orca chase. It had the orca chase, and it had- do you know what else it had? A rock falling at you while you were on the fucking Is this the end? Please be the Why end. Why are they so obsessed with Orcas trying to kill Sonic? I don't understand. Fuck it. Orcas hate Sonic. They're the Hedgehog's <laughs> natural enemy. <laughs> Fuck you, Dolphins. Sonic! Sonic's not allowed at SeaWorld. He was carrying oh, no. a car! The debris is such bullshit. Once, <laughs> once the boxes are, like, bouncing, they can't hurt you. But while they're stationary on the ground, they damage you. Cause, cause while they're in the air, there's no friction holding it to the ground or something. I don't know. I don't think I don't think a wooden box would be able to hurt Sonic, especially considering he can go through metal willy nilly. The hedgehog type Pokemon is super effective against steel, but not very effective yeah. against grass. <laughs> Yeah, remember, remember when a Pokemon hit, hit, does quick attack on a, on like a Steel type, and they suffer recoil automatically? Oh, you don't? Why not? Because it never fucking happened. We don't really have a Pokemon that's, that's whole thing is being fast. Oh yeah, Skarmory. Skarmory's. Oh, well, we do, yeah. huh? That's oh, not okay. like Skarmory. the thing that he's, it's designed around necessarily. It's Pokedex mentioned does mention it being fast. Some of the fastest ones are Deoxys has a speed mode. Uh, Cartana, the paper sword, the Ultra Beast. Oh, yeah. I have cut a worthless object. Once again, I cut a worthless object again. Again, again. That's the only Pokemon besides Meowth that can almost talk to people, because he also is like, hey, hey, leave it to me, and he cuts the, uh, the uh, comet in half, the meteor in half, and then after it cuts the meteor, so that was a good cut. Sonic says, always follow the speed limit, even during an apocalypse. <laughs> I always think about, I always think about the Cyanide and Happiness short, where like, they cut the price in half, 
and the guy keeps cutting shit in half to the point where he cuts an atom in half and blows blows up like everything. <laughs> and I want to see that guy go up against Cartana because he split the Earth in half. <laughs> I want to see them fight. <laughs> No one really talks about Scourge the Hedgehog. You want to talk about Scourge? We can talk about Scourge. Isn't that isn't that evil Sonic? That's green, uh yeah, we're, Sonic. it's like it's it's basically like Reverse World, where it's like oh everyone is the opposite of who they are. In, oh yeah, the Freedom Fighters world. are called the Suppression Squad. It started yeah, out that or way, like that. and then and Evil Scourge Sonic is is the king of his world because he oh, took no. over the government. He oh, usurped he... his father and took over the government. He was an evil Sonic with sunglasses, and then he, like, touched a, the Master Emerald or was corrupted or something, and he turned green, right? The Master yeah, Emerald's what, like, what hey, happened? fuck you. No, no, no. No, no, no. What happened is that he touched the Master Emerald, and it swapped his eye color and his fur color. So his eyes turned blue and his fur turned green. Oh. Why did that happen? I have no idea. Because I literally comics. don't remember. <laughs> Why is the category the Genesis game? Because Twitch doesn't have Sonic 2006. People wanted this to be to forget this game it ever existed, and we won't let them. <laughs> Nobody will let them forget that. Hey, guess what? It doesn't exist. I can't escape it. They are so terrified to touch anything related to this game. Like they refuse to let silver be related even like a little in the main plot of any mainline game. I wish he's it's not, not allowed. Poor Silver, it's not his fault that like the set gets sucked hard. And like and like people are gonna uh, people are gonna be like, no, he was involved in the plot of forces. I'm like one fight scene doesn't make him involved in the plot of forces. No, he had also, a cameo forces, in forces doesn't have a plot. <laughs> I love that that uh, the, the dub of Sonic Forces tried to make it edgier than it was. Like they said, "Oh, Tails completely lost it." <laughs> Just as if as if he went fucking insane, started cutting ears off of like off of like people. Like, like why am I going? Things. What's going on? <laughs> oh, <laughs> let's try that again. What's happening? I'm scared. I got a one up, radical. <laughs> Speedy. <laughs> Fucking fix it fix are more interesting than the actual game Sonic Forces. Like, <laughs> come on now. Uh, I was gonna say, as many games get remasters, it'd be nice to see some games that, like, didn't get it right the first time get remasters. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, this could like this? this could use it, yeah. It's <laughs> not a remastering, that's mastering. Or a remake. <laughs> These are unmastered versions of the games. <laughs> I'm glad you're enjoying my jokes. <laughs> yeah. make, encourage me to make more of them. I don't. I don't want to discourage you, Jack. I really don't. No, no, no. I'm, I'm glad so, you are. I'm so giggly that you could jingle keys in front of my face and I'd find it fucking hilarious. Like okay. my humor is so like in the garbage. I still laugh at YouTube poops. Like I still find those funny. I, I don't I know do why. Too. No, I do too. I've seen that YouTube poop. The price is rice. <laughs> half, half the time I'm just looking at an object that's like sitting there on my bed and I'm giggling in my ass off and my family's like, what's wrong with you? I'm like, I don't know. You're just, you're just naturally <laughs> happy. Cool. <laughs> Wish more people were naturally happy. Don't oh. ever listen. Don't ever listen to everywhere at the end of time. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a Blade Runner line. See, I'm so happy most of the time and then when I go onto Twitter, I become an animal. <laughs> That happens to everybody, so I guess it's normal. Twitter, Twitter has no, the no to bring other, the worst out of people. No other website does that. You know what's that? Like Twitter is the one that turns us all into like vicious animals. <laughs> like, uh, it's cause, what is it? Because everybody's using it, and and you, and I, I don't know, like. I do fine on Twitter. Well, the, the secret is that the, the, the CEO, uh, the creator of Twitter, uh, inserted a virtual hypnosis. So that's <laughs> no, the secret is that... Uh, jump failed. You jump failed, I understand. Your jump failed, I understand. Don't worry the about logo. It. <laughs> it's not a bird. You heard that, right? The guy who, who like, who was in charge of 
What happened? Okay, I what just happened got there? fucking shot out he of the hit. sky. <laughs> Wait, did the guy who made the logo actually say it's not a bird? I think somebody involved in Twitter was like, no, it's not a bird. No! What? Okay, I, I remember the- Okay, no, I remember the story now. Basically, you remember the Emoji movie? Yeah, yeah. So, Emoji movie, they, they were gonna have a, a cameo by the Twitter uh, logo. They were gonna, like, it was gonna fly him away, but then the, peop the people who were, like, involved with, like, cool, like, doing the thing between uh, the people creating the Emoji movie and Twitter were basically like, okay, you cannot portray the Twitter logo as a bird. Don't don't do that. And oh no! Well, what the fuck is it? It's not a bird. <laughs> it's not a bird. <laughs> no, that's that's literally. Well, what is it? It's not a bird. <laughs> but they wanted. To, they, did they want it to be like an, u an upper class gentleman? Did they want it to be voiced by Chris Lee? <laughs> I, I don't think they. I think they wanted to avoid it to do like bird calls and stuff. I don't know. That's I don't like know that why meme. Be so... That's like, that's like the meme of that guy, that got anime guy with glasses who's like looking at a butterfly and he goes, "Is this a pigeon?" <laughs> you just look at the Twitter no, no, logo no. and go, "This is not bird." <laughs> this is not a bird. <laughs> what? Why? Why? <laughs> Thank you, Sonic. That helps. Why is this, why is this level it, so trash? <laughs> this level. I don't think this is even the worst mock speed section level. I think there's a worse one after this. There is. Yeah. There's, no, there's I, I definitely know. one where, like, you're changing, like, uh... It's like Speed Highway, where, like, you're you're running on a thing that's sideways. Okay, but is there at least a save point near near it? I don't remember. I did not get the... I did not recover in time to jump yeah. before that happened. I was not given mock that speed option. Sections, mock speed sections were... Uh, like, they like I do said this, before, like I would, said before, these are proof that you can't possibly program a, a thing in a Sonic game where he goes actually at the speed of sound. Okay, this I, is I what it would look like in real life. <laughs> you know what? Well, no, you know it what was a better version of this. Uh, yes. They did it. They did this better in uh, in Sonic Unleashed. Yeah. Because they had them on like tracks, and then you could switch between them. So it's a mobile runner. That's yeah, how I you like do track. it better. I don't like, yeah, I, that was the one thing I didn't like the most about, you know, Sonic Heroes, is that, like, mm. oh, you have to manually switch between the rails, and there's no, there's no way to homie attack it or anything. I'm like, no! <laughs> Why would you do this? Like, there is a feet below an endless pit. Why? <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, the way to do... Like so Sonic Speed Sonic would have to be like slowed perception, like super hot. Yeah. Yeah. Super Quick so hot. Super hot. What? A, a wheel hit me! <laughs> you got it. Dude, you see Mythbusters? You got a section of a wheel, like the the, the rubber of the wheel hitting you and decapitating you. <laughs> now I'm just now I'm just picturing a mod. What, or like a crossover fan between Sonic and Super Hot. I why did you said you, you all you literally said was the rubber of a tire could decapitate you and I'm just over here giggling. <laughs> you, 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 no, this is actually <laughs> yes. this is actually a true thing. Mythbusters did a test where there's a myth of like tires exploding on the like like truck tires exploding on a highway and yeah. it, it, like like it, it, it can decapitate you. And they did it by basically taking a like a piece of rubber from a tire uh, later on in the mix because they, they tried uh, tried doing it a certain way and it just wasn't able to like hit him like in the way they wanted. So they, they decided to uh, fix that by basically uh, you know, by basically taking the tire and manually shooting it out really fast. <laughs> Damn it. This is that why Sonic shouldn't be in the park. <laughs> yeah, and, and then they, they fired the dummy and the dummy's head but it was torn from its body. I feel like they, they showed us Mythbusters at least three times in high school for science class. This is informational. Um, I like Mythbusters. Um, I, I for remember, some reason. The one I remember more vividly was uh, one where they were using uh, jean pants to slide down like a ski lift rope. Oh, and yeah, I remember that true. because a guy who was reviewing a movie called Frozen. No, not that yes. one. Yes, uh, yes, I know that yeah. one. 
Yeah, it was Frozen. one where it was like, they were trying to say that like the ski lift rope is like razor wire. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking That's about? Great. <laughs> That's great. I, I keep telling people, every time I, that I, I think of that movie, I end up telling like the co-workers and stuff about like, hey, which Frozen did you see? Like, which Frozen? I thought there's only one. I'm like, yo, there's two Frozens. They tell me, yeah, you're hey. familiar with the, the Disney one with like the two sisters, but there was another one, which is a horror movie about three people stuck on a ski lift and they just laugh. Hey, did you know that when it's it's like below zero, you don't see your breath come out of your mouth and oh, yeah, anymore? Like, no? <laughs> the guy trying to pause it that, like, they were so cold that their, that their internal body temperatures were outside the more they, 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 they... It's dumb. It has the same energy of that one part of So This is Basically JoJo's Sorry. Bizarre Adventure where it goes, Did you know that when you're in zero gravity, you pee your pants because your kidneys think they have too much blood? Of course you didn't, because that's wrong. <gasps> Finally! <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> you were dying literally at like the last few seconds of this level. Because the fucking the tornado was carrying a car. Oh, by the way, the, the tornado, tornado stopped. Tornado was still there, by the way. Like I wanna, I wanna point that. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. There's it's two like, buildings oh, oh, that it can't get done. through. All right, I guess I'll stop. <laughs> Frank, B, solid B. What a polite, what a polite tornado that is. <laughs> I'll you know get that saying? hedgehog next time. It's very nice that this uh, that this game just uh, is just giving you bees. <laughs> Not the bees. Oh, they're in my eyes. Doctor Bees. Oh, yeah, yes. you can play as Shadow now. Cool. We can we can, can uh, go to either one of those. I guess I guess it would have to be like a long chain of levels because there's not like a destroyed future overworld area, is there? No. No. Why would we want to do that? That sounds interesting. There's a bunch of humans in the destroyed future going, man. This place and sucks, they're still, right? They're still wearing the same clothes as they do in Soliana. And still doing like, the they're same. perfectly fine. <laughs> they look the same. You got that guard just just in front of a destroyed car going, man. This sucks. <laughs> One girl's on her cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> man, it'd be nice if I get a reception. Oh hey. Oh hey. <laughs> it's Memphis Seventeen. <laughs> With no mouth. Hey, do you guys want to maybe go in there? No? Okay. The, what, what would they do? They just run in there and Shadow would kick his ass. Wait. We can't interfere with minute. the continuity we don't know about. Oh yeah, that's right. Because if they inter if they go here and interfere now, then they'd be violating Zelrog's law. Because this hasn't I happened want, yet. I want to say it, but it's probably, it's, it's probably still a spoiler, so I won't say it yet. Good. I'll wait, I'll wait until, like, a certain time travel thing. Because <laughs> there is a specific rule to this. Have you ever seen Time Crimes, Saucy? No. Nope. Yeah, Time Crimes is a, is a uh, Mexican, I think, Spanish or Mexican film about, like, time travel. And it's Zelrog's Law compliant 100%. That's why I'm, like, showing it to you, like, hey, look, this, this movie is is like, it follows your version of time travel to the letter. It is very wacky. Well, I don't want to say wacky necessarily, but it's just a, a time travel situation that just gets worse and worse and more convoluted over the course of the movie. Yeah. As more people have fuck guys, with time travel. Have you guys seen Looper? Um, no. I want to, though. It's oh, like, okay. it's like, it's like Bruce Willis's Twilight Years before he just decided there's, to strictly do directed video stuff. I won't say what it is, but there's a scene where, like, I'm supposed to be, like, going, like, oh, man, that's fucked up, and all I can do is laugh my ass off because of how dumb it is. That's what that's what I do a lot. If, if this if scene's, like, trying to be all dramatic, and I'm just like, what the fuck? This is insane. <laughs> I had dumb. <laughs> Hello, Jeter. What, Derek Jeter? The swimmer? Nah. Meanwhile, you guys are so I thought he slow. meant Vegeta, and he was just saying it in a southern accent. Hey, cool. Yeah, I like Vegeta. Vegeta. <laughs> you know what? I, I like to think that Sonic was, had, just had to run on the ground in Crisis City. Meanwhile, Knuckles and Tails just flying over it, going, what the fuck is Sonic doing? Can you please emote, Rouge? Can you do anything other than I want to fuck? 
Like, can you please try to do anything? You mean we've got to go through there? If you don't do like it, you can stay here. You've got to be kidding. She's not even trying. She knew that she knew that the voice actress knew that this project would suck, and then ever since then she's just not been able to act ever again. Oh, is no, she, the... she she sounds like this in every time she plays Rouge in anything. She sounds like this in Sonic <laughs> X, like everything. Just I hate her, it. Just imagine her doing her lines, and then immediately after she walks out, go pay me. I wonder if this is where's the my saxophone. <laughs> I wonder if this is the one they got back for the Yu-Gi-Oh redub when they tried to do an uncut version. God, where everybody just sounded like they were dead. They got through like <laughs> nine episodes. The voice actor sounded like none of them wanted to do it, and then they just stopped making it. Yeah, because you know what? For as bad as the four kids version is, at least it had energy. I love how in interviews, even Dan Green talks about how he looked at the script for his characters and was like, these guys are kind of gay. <laughs> like... What, like the... the yeah. You, you yeah, know the you, pharaoh? Oh, I was supposed to jump, not jump in the lava. I'll do better this oh. time. <laughs> it's fine. Lava's not instant death, but, uh, but running into a pipe at like 500 miles per hour is... <laughs> uh... I was about to say that uh, that yeah the uh, Yu Gi <clears throat> Yu Gi Oh is is like has like the, has like a really high uh, LGBT uh, fandom. There's like a lot of uh, because for it. because every show has a checklist of things that they have to have in the show, uh, and I keep track of that checklist for every single spinoff that comes out, and not once has it failed to check everything on the list. Like Are you talking about Yu-Gi-Oh in, in particular? Yeah, because every show has uh, ridiculous hairdos that no other anime has possibly had. Check. <laughs> uh, a female duelist who is garbage. Oh, yeah. Damn it, really? <laughs> always the case. <laughs> yeah. Yes, because it always happens. Like, maybe she's good at first, but eventually she just fades into obscurity and either is bad at every duel she does or never duels for the rest of the show. Like, it's weird. I don't the, get it. There are characters like that in every show, just in general, was too, though. Yeah, and then there's the weird, um... There's the weird, unintentional, homosexual under undertones. Uninten it's you say always, unintentional, but... Yes, because I don't think a single person... Like, nobody has acknowledged it. Damn. I wish, I wish they would, too. I wish they would one, one day in Yu-Gi-Oh! Just be like, just be like, hey, I actually, I actually do, like, I love you. And then the other person's like, I love you, too. And then everybody kind of, like, says, oh, yeah, those, uh, those two guys are, are in a relationship now. And then they go, oh, okay. That makes sense. The other two things are at least one best friend character who remains best friends throughout the entire show. Joey. And the, yeah, and then the other, and then the last one is a character who barely emotes and pop and bonus points if they have a little little sibling. Like, it's in almost oh, every show. Yeah, the Kaiba. There's almost the... one in every show. You mean every you know, when I see spinoffs, I like to see spinoffs of like of like stuff like you know reinvent sometimes like formula or do something new. But no, apparently Yu Gi Oh is just like hey, we'll just do the same formula because it's made to sell over. toys. Like the, let's, oh well, we're going to the Yu Gi Oh factory. Got to turn turn out our quota of uh of Yu Gi Oh like tropes and characters. I can't remember if it's in any other spinoff, but in Arc 5, at least, like the fifth spinoff, um, they literally have what I just talked about, where it's like uh, a stoic, uh, egotistical duelist who's always challenging the main character and has a little sibling. Like, it's just Kaiba. It's just Kaiba again. There's no reason for this. Why do you guys have to do the same shit every time? Because people still watch and kids still buy toys. I quit after Arc 5, but, like, I, it's still going to this day. You know what the best part of Yu-Gi-Oh! is? It, it is the uh, dub actors actually, you know, deciding to have fun with the roles, because there was that one dude uh, in uh, GX 
who, uh, like, Sean, it was Sean Schimmel again, who saw, who yeah. was like, you're gonna voice a, you're gonna voice a, uh, a tough guy, and he's like, I'm gonna do it my way, and he decided to, <laughs> to voice him, like, he claimed Mike Tyson, but he instead sounded like a kid. That's Just the one really where he's voice. like, that's right, poopy head. My mommy says I'm really strong. He's just this guy who looks like he should be out of Fist of the North Star. <laughs> in in the ARC 5 English dub, uh, Jason Griffith, who voices uh, Sonic in this game, actually, uh -huh. uh, had to do a voice of a character. But the thing is, is that for some reason, uh, they told him to do a very over-exaggerated Italian accent. So it just sounds like Italian Sonic. <laughs> so we have a canon voice for so Samari. Weird. Man, why didn't Ruggeton cover that? All I know about <laughs> RP are the fucking Tyler sisters. Oh yeah, they're 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 pretty good. <laughs> the, the mean girls of Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah. It's like, if, it's like if like if two two people from a Mean Girls movie like just decided to do to do Yu-Gi-Oh and that's the character. Like okay, at least that's something. Well, that I line. I remember when I was still active in the fandom during Arc Five, still being like you know coming out every week. I remember I made a ton of memes making fun of the fact that Zuzu, the main girl on the show, all she does is get kidnapped and scream for Yuya to come save her. Oh, like, like after Elise. a certain point. Yeah, like after a certain point, that's all she does. It's that's literally a fact. <laughs> Because the show is not written well, people, <laughs> other than the main character, aren't allowed to like have development or get stronger. It's like, no, no, you're the you're the Princess Peach. You're going to stay the Princess Peach forever. With women, women actually accomplishing something by themselves in a Yu-Gi-Oh show? What are you insane? How about just have a protagonist that's a woman in a Yu-Gi-Oh show? For that once. hasn't happened yet. That try I it. Yet. Try it, and then she could have like a like a like a like a homoerotic relationship with another woman, and that'd be something different. Oh yeah, and the other thing on the checklist was the that every protagonist character has to have a name starting with the letters Y U. There is no exceptions. <laughs> Yuki, there you go. Yeah, yeah, have Yuki. <laughs> Yuki, Yuki Yoshima. I'd or watch something. that. She sounds cute. I would watch that. But no, women aren't allowed to have an accomplishment in Yu-Gi-Oh. You know, <laughs> why would we do that? You know, even as a kid, I kind of knew that, like, like, wow, why are all these RPG people, like, guys? Let's just let's mix it up a little bit. Like, Where are all the girls? I'm like, wait, Samus is a girl? That's fucking amazing. Because everybody's like, oh, oh, yeah. it's a guy space marine. And I'm like, and I'm like oh, it's a, okay, you can't tell. I remember, I remember when I first heard about that, because I never played it. And I heard about it years later. I was like, "Well, that sounds like a pretty funny twist." And I, and you know what? Yeah, you just you play it, and then she sort of super she's a woman the entire time. That's 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 how you spring it on people. It's like, it's like oh yeah, that that person you were playing was a woman the entire time. And you're like, oh, and she's like kicking ass. And that's kind of why I think that uh, <laughs> that a lot of people didn't like fucking. Uh, they didn't really fucking like uh, that. Uh, what was that that Metroid game with uh, other M? Metroid M. Yeah, other M. Yeah, people did. Yeah, because like I remember uh, I remember hearing some guys talking about this at some point during a podcast or something, where it was like the original thing was like Samus was not supposed to have heels. Like there was a big fucking note on her design sheet, like don't put heels on these shoes, and they did it anyway. <laughs> Also, uh, with other M, like the Samus's characterization, like she's a woman, sure, but it doesn't really matter because she's just this stoic, like bounty, like hunter who like fights through things, takes a lot of damage, and just is like, okay, I'm gonna kill this person. And then other M just decided to, like, they, they're, they're, I'm just a picture of the design meeting, just them going, ah, she's all, she's all woman, she'll, she'll have emotional problems, and it's just like, dude, hey, guys have emotional problems too. Like, I, I have, I have my share of emotional problems. I've fucking burst into tears a lot. And then, it's like, it's like the, it's like the, do men even have feelings meme? <laughs> yeah, I do. Like, I, I, like just yesterday, I was getting frustrated at work. I, I came home and I was just like really sad. Oh god. Oh, oh no. no. Oh no. I forgot. About it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, the the two things I remember from Etchmoid M that always make me laugh my ass off are one, the baby, the, the baby, baby. 
and two, and two that scene of Samus looking through a window while the colonel, uh, the colonel or some shit is like about to sacrifice himself, and she just gives a big thumbs down. <laughs> like, <laughs> wait, what, what just, the fuck? Wait, she, she <laughs> behaved like Batista betraying the fuck. I'm like, pretty sure. Kicking Randy like, Orton out of evolution. <laughs> I'm pretty sure some character was about to sacrifice himself on the other side of a door, and she put her thumb down in disapproval. And I'm like, I'm supposed to look at the scene and be crying right now? Like, no. Thumbs down. She yeah, gave she... him a red down vote. Like, what is this? Just like he reacted the same way. That's like, oh, no, that was the, she was uh, the she was the audience looking at the scene, going like, what the fuck am I looking? Like, that's so stupid. How's, uh, how's Knuckles controlling, by the way, Zellrog? Uh, well, you guys have been talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! and, and, uh, and shit for about half an hour now. Oh, Sonic sorry. said a line <laughs> that was uh, actually Sonic-esque, and now I'm Knuckles. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, cool, he didn't air in himself. He didn't, he didn't go, what is this? <laughs> what is my life? I don't want to fight I really, things. They, it's gonna make me Sonic what you Heroes. Will about Aaron, but that was iconic. <laughs> the what now? Uh, the former, uh, the former uh, Game Grumps was formerly JonTron and Air and uh, Ego Raptor, and uh, and I think Sonic Plus Six was the last game they did together, and uh, and fucking uh, Air like Ego Raptor was playing as Knuckles, and he got stuck in a certain way. Uh, a wall climbing. I just went and through then, the floor. And then he just left, and, and uh, Ego Raptor just left in disgust. You, oh, you're doing it again. Got it. And then Jontron's like, Aaron, come back, I love you! Ah, oh, fuck it. Oh, do I have to kill everything? Maybe I you just have to, have to touch this. You didn't light oh, I have to things. hit them! Yes. I thought Sorry. I just had to walk into them. No. <laughs> no, you see, this game. If this game was any good, it'd tell you what to do. No, that would make sense. <laughs> also, Yuki is related to Sonic. We're uh, we're talking about uh, the voice actors who were. Uh... Yeah, Dan Green played. Um, Knuckles. Played Yami. <sighs> what? Thanks for yeah. the invisible wall, Sonic. Why? How come he can't break those? What the fuck are these made of? I'm. I'm not sure if either of you are familiar with Sonic and the Black Knight at all. I'm I'm familiar with it. I know it exists. It's probably better than fucking uh, Sonic 06. I remember a scene where uh, alternate uh, King Arthur World Knuckles tries to kill himself, and then Sonic takes the sword away, and he's like, "Give me a break, you drama queen!" I'm like, "Dude, what's wrong with you?" <laughs> <laughs> what a fucking asshole! <laughs> like he's got the gun in his Ooh. mouth. And he's like, I'm gonna do it. And he's like, Give me a break. <laughs> Show the fuck it. What the? <laughs> 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 he's, you he's don't need an actual this. cliff. You just need to believe in the heart of the cliff. <laughs> we jiggling? By the way, I, I don't mean to like piss you off further, but those I think those lights are timed, so... Oh. Oh yeah, I think they are, actually. I remember. <coughs> Fuck. So once once you hit all three of them, you gotta, uh, you gotta haul ass back here. Okay, so there's one, two, three... I have no rings. Yep, you are correct. And you are dead. <laughs> Rip. All the way back here, huh? Okay. Rip, Knuckles, you're gone. Knuckles. Why is what he happened? here again? Knuckles. Um, because there's a Chaos Emerald near here. We're trying to go home. Trying to get out of this fucking uh, piece of shit universe, like timeline. This nightmare. <laughs> this timeline sucks. Let's let's leave. <laughs> Hold your fire! That hedgehog isn't black. <laughs> what? No, that's not shadow. <laughs> shadow. It is shad. It is shadow black. That's Memphis. Memphis. By the way, I should mention that uh, that shadow so far is very chill in this game. He hasn't really said much. 
Yeah, he's just kind of like, hey, Sonic, you want to you wanna team up? He's like, are you sure you're Shadow? How can I do faster than that? Did I miss yeah, you, one? You were moving pretty fast. I don't know what it wants from you. It wants you to do it faster. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Or you I missed, missed one. one. Whoops. Bye! Oh, Have fun oh. down here! <laughs> Stay here, Knuckles. I don't need you anymore. Knuckles, I'm leaving you. <laughs> I'm with someone else. Right through the fire. Do you think if we look hard enough somewhere in this level, we can find the yellow Metarex sinking into the lava? Uh. Give it a thumbs up. Whoop. I hope we find a one-up somewhere, or finish Wait, stop. The level. Don't move. Stop moving. It was funnier when I was moving. <laughs> I'm standing on the ceiling. Believe it what or not, I'm walking on air. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Ow. you watched Sinner Snob, too? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, fine. That was a popular <laughs> song. <laughs> And there go there goes your last ring. <laughs> you have one life left. I hope that it'll allow you to save before the boss battle. Just made it. I don't think it will. G B. Jeter said he hates me for some reason. I don't know what what point of the conversation he started hating me. Oh. <laughs> we're probably we were talking about about uh, feminist Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry that the show doesn't like women. <laughs> like... Oh God. It's not just that show. Like, Nar you know what? Naruto would be a lot better if Sakura was allowed to take Zabuza's sword and kick ass. Which is where I thought they were going, because she's got super strength. It'd be nice if she just was, like, just this small ninja with a giant sword. Be like, ah, come and get me, you fuckers! The only episode of Boruto I've been able to sit down and watch without barfing is the one where Sasuke comes back to town and is like, Oh shit, I don't know how to be a dad. <laughs> So what do you know about Naruto? Absolutely fuck all other than Sasuke and Itachi's backstory. Ah. Uh. Okay. That's, you, uh... that's fine. And, and, what well, you told me about Naruto having a demon. You know, whatever. Oh, that, okay, it's Iblis again. Fight Iblis. It's, this is a... uh, a Devil May Cry boss. <laughs> it does look like that. Did it allow you to save? I don't remember. Oh no. <laughs> I don't remember either. How hard can Sonic save? Satan be? It's isn't the, isn't the, the, Iblis the name of like uh, the devil in Islamic or Arabic yes. or something? That is correct. It named it. They named it basically the devil. That's Ow! <laughs> Every time, every time he shouts, Fun, the mic uh, cuts off. It's just like it's just fun. Fun fact: the only time that anyone in any Sonic game has said the word Iblis at, was Sonic and the Secret Rings. That's it. It's the only time anyone has said the name Iblis since this game. Hey, cool! You're able to lava walk. Good job. What? So if there's a Satan in the Sonic world, who's God? Sonic. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh. So how far back are we? That's a good question. Iblis. Oh, hey, okay. great. All right, cool. <laughs> okay, good. The I devil... was about to be terrified. <laughs> the devil came down to Moby as he was looking to make a deal. Sonic God. Uh, isn't that fucking? I would think that would be chaos. I mean, chaos was the god of chaos, is what they called him, but he was actually a mutated Chow. Yeah, he's just—he's a—he protects the Chow sanctuary and all that shit. Oh, so so he. You yeah, know what? he th he himself was a Chow. That's why he cares about Chow so much. You know what? Because he is I, one. I, you know what? I think that that means that just saw the Sonic verse uh, is a polytheistic religion, like. Is a polytheistic uh, 
like uh religion not religion uh world yeah it's there was multiple gods there was a genie in secret and... rings but that was inside a storybook right i thought they hide in lamps what the fuck <laughs> and in sonic adventure 2 you can make a chow uh that looks like chaos so i guess he's not the only one He's, he can make a successor can have just Chow Guardian, yeah. just Chow Guardian species that are pure liquid. I wish we could see a Chaos Forms 2 and 5, because we never do, and I want to know what they look like. He's the legendary Super Chow. <laughs> Only one of them ever attained the form! He, he, he angled, he angled the dangle. He shizzled my fizzle. Uh, boy, I wish this camera worked with me better. Yeah, it doesn't look like the camera is working really, really good. Sonic actually has a concussion. That's why the camera is so weird. <laughs> He's hungover. <laughs> He's drunk right now. He found Sonic's supply, bad for the last day. supply of like liquor. And he was just, That's yeah. not a jump I can make. So you probably don't want to be standing there. Okay. <laughs> I actually don't remember how to how to fight this boss. I do, but I guess I'll wait for Zelrog to figure it out before I tell him. Well, I can't quite jump to that one yet. Oh, now you now you fight him. Now you hit okay. him. Okay, so I hit one of the things there and then he go. goes for it. Why? Wow, he, he look at he go. Can I look down now? Trust no. fall. What boing? What a look convenient spring. He grace. He majesty. Oh, he destroyed him. Nope. Yeah, lava oh, can. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the right stuff. The right stuff. Wait, this is randomly dropping a new kids on the block line. Well, she said the oh, oh. Oh, okay. I just, I just, I just didn't realize you remembered who the new kids on the block were. Hello, old Rye. I don't actually achievement hunter reference that song a lot. I actually have, a, I actually have a kind of a lame Sonic story I, I'd be willing to share with you too. Okay, t Please, tell it to yeah. Satan so he can hear it. So one, one, <laughs> so one day, uh, I was no, this is my personal story. It's not uh -huh. like I, I have some camping. I was one day I was like playing through Doom Three, right? And mm -hmm. I was like played through the entirety of it. And I just, I just pretended the main character was Sonic. I don't know why. I, I don't know why I did that. I, I was just. How so? Just like. Gotta just, go like, back. Pretending, I was just pretending that like Sonic was uh, was the main character in uh, in Doom Three. Did this affect your gameplay in any way? No, no. I just, I just was like, I, I was just like, I, I saw he's got. A, he got a pistol, he's like shooting demons, like why not? Why the fuck not? Gotta cleanse the unholy best! Is that not what we're doing? <laughs> Gotta slay <laughs> That's literally what we're doing right now! Why, why do you think I'm relating this story? Because this is I was reminded of that. He does look like a doom enemy. Iblis. Do you hate PewDiePie? I have no um, opinion on PewDiePie. I don't even know him. I have never watched his stuff because I am an adult. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah! Adult! I think he's okay. You know, you know what? It, it, PewDiePie would have been a whole lot worse if... Uh... He's YouTube's official father, so I guess I have to respect him. Hey, what's wrong? Is that size just for show? Hey, what's wrong? Is that size just for show? Silver was looking at him, just stuck on Iblis. He would be so pissed. <laughs> this is the Iblis trigger. Iblis is triggered. <laughs> Mom said it's my turn on the Xbox. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Lol says Sonic LMFAO. Hashtag epic fail. 
I think this is one of the easiest uh, bosses in the game, actually. Oh, well, I'm gonna well, die immediately you know. after you say that. Camera, please! Oh. Th that's the only real challenge, is the fucking camera. Okay. Uh, is that good? That's what she said! <laughs> oh, uh... You gotta... Yeah. Days, go for it. Yeah, you... I forgot that I leap 5,000 meters into the air after impact. I thought I might fall into the lava. It was his ab I'm about to die phase. Do you hate Sonic games? No, I don't hate Sonic games. No. The only one I really liked much is Sonic Adventure 2, but... The only Sonic games I hate with absolute fervor are Sonic Forces and Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric. They're garbage and have no value. So I think I think e this game is better than Sonic Boom because at least this game is, is kind of funny to play. I don't know about Sonic Boom. I don't know how frustrating that game is. No problem. It's See. not as technically broken as this, I will say, but it's so oh, I... boring and uninteresting. Oh, that, that makes it even worse. Like the story is not even funny, <laughs> in like in yeah. a bad like it's not even like a oh this is funny because it's so bad like no it's just boring it doesn't mean anything. Like I can see this game having like a cult following just because of how 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 uh, bizarre the game is. But Sonic Boom, I like most people uh, like like I've never heard people go go like say hey. This game is like horror, is like funny bad. It's just Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric is just. Do you think people would? Okay, wait. No, I'm being unfair. The the scene where Sonic goes, he dodged my spin dash moves. No one's ever done that before. <laughs> that that one got me a laugh. That one made me chuckle. I'll that one that. actually pisses me off more. <laughs> do you think people would be happy if they did do like a master of this game, where? Same story, same characters, <laughs> said that. same production values, but they made the gameplay at least as good as Sonic Adventure 2. Then you know what? People I would, would be actually about that. would people yeah, no, like that, or would they say, "Well, now it's just forgettable"? It depends on how good the gameplay is, because at least the story is still bizarrely bad. So, well, okay, I won't say that. That's I'll, a matter I'll say, of opinion. <laughs> I won't say that. I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily call it worse than Sonic Adventure ones. So, no, it's not Soliana. It's Soriana. Actually, you know, speed running through Sonic Adventure made me realize that some characters have almost nothing. Yeah. <laughs> like you could complete their their sections in like ten minutes. <laughs> There's like four or five levels for Amy. Yeah, because I want to play. I want to play yeah. through Sonic Adventure one just uh, here. Lena Inverse talk for like for like an hour about how much she wants to like fuck Sonic. It wasn't Lena yet. <laughs> this game it wasn't has Lena, Lena yet. Okay, never mind. I think this is this in Sh Shadow was her first game was Lena Amy. Okay. So she's in Lena this. Inverse is who I, is what I said. Yeah, Lena Inverse, uh, Lisa Ortiz is the name of the actress who voices Amy in the Four Kids cast. Here we go. Oh, hey. Yeah, please do. <laughs> Now's a good time to go I try Shadow. I remember reading the lyrics of that Amy theme song from Sonic Adventure for the first time and going, Wow, this sounds like a fucking weirdo stalker. <laughs> she says she's gonna paint herself blue. Like, no normal person does that. Yeah. <laughs> no, from experience, no, no normal person. Unless they're, like, in a parade. Let's do, shit, let's do a bit of a Shadow. I was just looking at the progresses. I do, I do have some respect for people who cosplay Steven Universe that paint their whole body. That's some work. I appreciate that. I don't have that kind of patience. <laughs> God damn it, Shadow. All right, I do not hate you, but I will mute you if you keep flooding the chat. Adam be like a government agent, like fucking Nick Fury. I don't. I don't know what they were intending to do with him, but I know that Maria is no longer part of the story because she doesn't exist. And for some reason, actually, never mind. I won't say it yet. <laughs> I, I I want the bag. Just have Maria be like his friend, and then also have him be like a mo like a naturally born Demobian that is also like like genetically man. You could have it both ways. I've seen a lot of nice fan art of that actually. We're like uh, Sonic Boom Maria. 
where she's still hanging around and she's friends with uh, Sonic's crew, but is also like uh, friendly with Robotnik because he's her family. Wait, like, I is, Shadow, like is Shadow in Boom? Yeah, he is. But What's there's the story Maria there? doesn't exist. So what is Shadow then in Boom? I have no idea. <laughs> no, is no he... one has any fucking clue. He's just another movie, and I guess. They never established it in the show or the games. They didn't ever get Good around start. to that part. I don't know if the Boom comics do, but the games and the show do not. Okay, so uh, he died there. But I've only seen fan designs of like Cosmo the Cedrian or like Maria in like Boom style. Yeah. Which are interesting. I like the concept of Maria like getting along with both Eggman and Sonic. I like, like that. The that's funny. Just like, yeah, like that's really family, funny. Family, family. Like like she comes in, she's like she's like, Eggman, what are you doing? He's like, nothing. And then he's building a death ray. <laughs> 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 Nothing! <laughs> I'm, I'm making you a birthday present. <laughs> that would actually be pretty funny. I, I, I'm that would be mad. so good. I wish they would bring her back, dude. <laughs> so, so far, Shadow is just Sonic again. Yeah. Okay, yeah, well, that, I mean... Oh god, I just realized I have to hear more of Rouge's voice. <laughs> You know, uh. <laughs> there are there are worse ways to spend a Friday afternoon. <laughs> you right? <laughs> well, that wasn't the switch. No, you just go up there, then you can go find the switch. You see, just as I thought. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Wrong door. No. Shadow oh. is like uh, is like Sonic if he was more arrogant. Sonic he has an ego, but Shadow is arrogant. You can just tell between the two that Sonic is the '90s character and Shadow is the 2000s character. Was Silver <laughs> supposed to be the 2010s character? That's pretty funny. I guess he kind of fits that. <laughs> who would have been? Who would be the 2010 Sonic then? What what what, what kind Silver of? Silver is a millennial. <laughs> okay, so now we have so now we have to have a Zoomer Sonic. I don't know what's what characterizes 2010s like YouTube humor. The 2010 Sonic is Sanic. <laughs> Sanic. Sanic, son of Sonic. <laughs> it's like Boruto. Or I don't remember if I've talked about this, but I'm super into the theory that Silver is Shadow Sun. Oh, okay. Love I, it. I would... I thought I thought Silver would was Sonic's son, honestly. Yeah. Maybe it's another maybe it's another clone. Maybe they cloned Silver from Shadow and Sonic's DNA. And he just happened to be psychic. Canonically, Silver is like a child. Like he's fourteen. So is every not, Sonic okay. character. Yeah. This Everyone is... except Shadow who's fifty. Hey, it's Rush. <laughs> and Sonic is apparently sixteen. <laughs> yep. Teen Dad. Teen Dad. Let's talk about Sailor Moon, where uh, the like 15-year-old's daughter from the future comes to live with her, and she yeah. suddenly has to be like half a mom. Well, <laughs> she, she, she treats her more like a sister, though. Yeah. Like a, like a little teen, like bratty sister. Which makes sense, considering she's 14. So. It's good climbing it's animation. It's also revealed that, like, a uh, good princess, uh, Sailor, Sailor Moon, Neo Queen Serenity, actually draw like, writes like a child. Oh, that's, like, that's... Uh, there we go. It's a good just, spot. Good uh, hit, de good collision detection. I'm just picturing, like, a mime superhero, right? He's like, he has the ability to pantomime doing stuff, he could do it, and... They, like all these heroes have to scale the building and the mime has to like he's just pantomime and climbing it and he's able to climb it we haven't gotten there yet but the best season one monster of the week in ladybug is a mime and he's got really good choreography of course, of course amazingly the mime. french cartoon did put a lot of justice for the mime character i feel no, like really. reckless ladybug is like the epitome of like the frustrating aspects of shipping something. You haven't oh, seen Ranma. What the fuck is she doing? What was that? Uh, she throws stuff. Okay. 
Okay. What is that that she's throwing? She shoots bombs out of her pooch. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's very specific. <laughs> okay. She's got a snook! Wait, she's allowed to have bombs, but Tails isn't? No. I could not figure out how to break that ice below me. Uh. Because pressing B in the air does that. Maybe you have to throw it on the ice. Okay. Wow, yeah, that sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Physics! See, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it would be something dumb like that for this game. <laughs> Is a masterpiece. Yes. Yes. A seven out of ten. <laughs> seven, seven and a half, as Randy. Pitch I'm just gonna say. keep repeating my score for this game. Like. <laughs> Ow. And every time you say that, I just can't. I can't help but like remember, but like think of uh, Randy Pitchford saying that. What is he? He's moonwalking. Game. Robot. What are you doing? Is that robot actually like a fucking nightmare? Is that why it's like moving like that? It did move that like one. Like a Code Geass mech. Oh, Stop man. shining a light in my face! That'd be a fanfic if the fucking Sonic universe crosses over with the Code Geass universe. I mean, the gun, oh. G-U-N already uses mechs. Eggman uses mechs. Yeah, it'd just be Eggman versus Britannia. It'd be fucking funny. <laughs> it just sunk into the ice. Alright. I'm not gonna worry remember, about it. remember, Eggman's tech was, like, stronger than anything, uh... Like Earth had on Sonic X. It was true. So Eggman would just just Able run girl. circles around fucking Britannia. Well, it also didn't really show a lot of the stuff, a lot of the cool stuff that like Kokios anime mechs could do until like the end of season one of Sonic X, when the robot gets the emeralds and can flash step. Oh god. <laughs> that was. Oh look, a giant was... robot. It must be slow. Oh god, it can teleport. The president. That was the great. U.S. president is still canon. U.S. <laughs> Obama asked me to come pick you up. What? <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna ah. escort his daughters to a party. <laughs> wait, talking. Wait, wait. We talking about oh, the no. anime, the OVA yes, come now? On, trying, come trying. On, I tried several trying times. Up. There we go. We jack two yeah. now. I got. Chris. Okay, so pressing... I'm rolling backwards. How do I go forward? X. It's Mario Kart. Also, you got missiles. Now go back. Square. He even looks backwards. <laughs> he's a safe driver. Gotta be a responsible driver. And he's got, he's got his hand on the, on the top of the seat. That's good detail. Have you, uh, have you ever played any of the Sonic Riders? So Rider? Shadow is the only one who canonically has his driver's license, apparently. Sonic's, Shadow's the only one who's, like, willing to drive. He's like, look, Sonic, you can't go fast all the time, and Sonic's I'm like... I'm so sick of running, like, I just, I, no. <laughs> Shadow doesn't even like to run, he fucking, he fucking glides on his jet boots. Oh. <laughs> Am I cutting out for okay. both of you guys a lot? A little bit. Uh, it's fine. I, I just assume it's Discord. Saucy. Have you ever played the what? Sonic? Have you ever played the Sonic Riders games? I have actually. I played the original Riders game on the PS2. I am told that in these games, Eggman <laughs> can run backwards at 20 miles per hour, shoving trucks out of his way because he is a power class. Is this I, accurate? I can't confirm this because I haven't seen it, but Darn. I'll, I'll look into it for sure. I think if anybody would be able to have nano machines. Robotic. Yeah. He does, like, like superhuman feats of strength now and again. They just Sega doesn't want to acknowledge it. He doesn't want to because he feels like his true, his true power is science. Yeah. I and wish they would make an animated series that has the art style of the OP from the first Riders game. Because that's a good art style. I've never seen it, so I can't comment. Hello, Onvar. He like Shadow kind of pauses longer when he hits an enemy compared to Sonic. He needs to pose. Okay. Yeah, he's loading. <laughs> he's loading. Yes. He no, he's methodical. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Okay. 
he stunted on the ice and it broke because he was too powerful. There's no way uh, to like the dive ice was down intimidated. in this game. Like you don't have the bounce, you don't have the drill kick from Sonic Adventure. Bad touch hands. Gameplay. Gameplay. Bad touch. Gameplay. Put a big old caption over this that says gameplay. <laughs> the hands don't even hurt. You. They, they don't deal damage. A little bit. No, get away from me. This is just so this is Sonic I'm Heroes fucking... all over again. So you need to take out the searchlights. Which oh. I need a vehicle again for. Do I need to go back Does to where it originally spawned? I guess, yeah, I go back to where it spawned and then... Uh, or else maybe use your chaos powers. Is that a thing that can happen? Did that... <laughs> Believe it or not, I did not stick... I did not stand on that wall. <laughs> I no, you're back. not allowed to collect coins. That's illegal. I actually stopped holding forward because I thought I would stand on the wall. No, not that one. That one has a different rule set. <laughs> oh, you should have done that. Your car took slight damage. Oh, there's damage. By the way, it's it's got shadow colors. Shadow's literally just a fucking secret agent. Now he's James Bond. <laughs> you just Inspector picked... Shadow. Inspector pick... Shadow. You just <laughs> picked your shadow. Going to uh... stop hitting stuff. You're losing your vehicle. Oh, beep. Oh, okay. Couldn't save that. Have you seen that video, Jack? Uh, uh what? Inspector Shadow. Inspector I've Shadow. Not... I've not. You gotta show it to me. I showed okay. you the Godfrey Ho stuff last time. You gotta, you gotta do me a solid this time. <laughs> hey, there's a switch. Here you go. <laughs> oh boy. I don't even remember what's in this video. It's so old. I think that switch I'm turned on the lasers. I think that was a bad switch. Switch activated lasers. I thought it would deactivate the lasers. Why would there be a switch that? Oh, it's Inspector Gadget, except he's Shadow. <laughs> it's metal as well. So I can't seem to find it. There it is. This guy used to do Sonic vs. My Little Pony characters a lot. <laughs> fucking... Fucking the guy was handing Shadow the note, and he flips him off and leaves. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I destroyed five things. Now, how do I get... Uh-oh, uh-oh, I'm good. Wait, was there a laser up, like, beside the ravine? They really don't want people like that. No, there's another one. It's up there. This is like Eggman's base or something. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, oh. What? What? All right. Oh, safe by bullshit. <laughs> That's what I call it when the games glitch save your life. <laughs> God, I, I can just picture fucking Golden Eye, except it's Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> he's just fucking attacking the fucking. He's, he's like, strapped to the table with the laser, about to split him in half. <laughs> that's Goldfinger. Golden Eye is the one with the the kill the the uh, EMP kill set. Uh, okay, I, I've never actually watched a James Bond movie before. I've watched a lot of James Bond movies. <gasps> What is going on here? I can use the momentum from the missiles to propel myself backwards. Don't worry, we got our top guy on this. Oh no, I Austin powers it. Oh, he helped you. Oh, that's nice. You got a sliver of health left. I got this. Okay, there's another one. By the way, Shadow, like, I love how all vehicles Shadow Colors. Yeah! Shadow Colors. <laughs> I gotta get it moving no quickly and then belt. do that. 
No seatbelt, because I'm extreme. I don't know how to get that one up there. Just go up there and shoot it. It's, it's not, not this hard. one, the one behind. <laughs> Oh, they home. Okay. That's nice. That's convenient. Shadow, we got you an Aston Martin DB8, and it's in your colors. It's all black and red. And red. He's like, he's like, thanks, Tails. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Just Shadow the Hedgehog, except it's all James Bond films. If you... <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog if you in. Dr. Eggman. If you get into a flipped over buggy, it'll just flip over. <laughs> Didn't seem to work for me so far. Shadow the Hedgehog in from from Station Square with love. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> what? What? I have to what? start all over. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get the hardest one first. That is my plan. <laughs> we spent so long on the first level of Shadows thing. Oh my god. Shadow the Hedgehog. And... What other ones are there? Shadow, the... Shadow, Shadow and the gang in? <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog and the, the Hedgehog who loved me. <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog in... Uh, and Maria never dies. <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog and the emeralds are not enough. <laughs> no, uh, emeralds are forever would be would be that one. And, uh, <laughs> Mo the Mobius is Mobius is not enough would be would be that one. Uh, Chaos pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Octopussy oh. was the real name of a James Bond movie. Yes, yes, I, I still don't know what was up. I've never seen that Shadow, movie. Actually. Shadow the Hedgehog in The Menace from Canada, eh? Oh, Menace uh, from the North? That's, uh, the there's a Sly Cooper in, chapter. Uh, Shadow the Hedgehog in You Only... Oh, be though. You Only Die Twice. You, you Only Spin Dash Twice. <laughs> These are more good than they have any right to be. <laughs> I, I apologize. <laughs> Shadow, the, <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog in Casino Night Royale. Oh. No. <laughs> oh my god. Did I get them all? Am I done? Uh, no, there's one more. <laughs> I see the light. Thank you, Shadow. Uh... Oh, it's up there. How do you get up there? That's a good question, oh. Mega Man. I don't. I don't even know why I've been getting so much into Sly Cooper again lately. No, nothing new has happened. Like we're still dead in the water on game number five coming out. Like there's I don't no think it's ever gonna. I don't think it's ever gonna come out, honestly. Yeah, cause Sony won't let them make it. It's the movie literally flopped. just because Sony said no. <laughs> the movie flopped. They canceled the movie. Uh, this is a mistake. No, go yeah, for it. Yeah, because Ratchet and Clank it. tanked. Oh. <laughs> oh, I needed to go here. The movie tanked, therefore it's... the games probably won't do any good. It's, it's whatever. The original trilogy it. is the best experience anyway. Oh, that was it. Oh, uh, Sly? <laughs> Where are your feet? They're in the snow, obviously. No, your feet are the snow. Okay. This seems like this does feel like a Ratchet and Clank mission. It was like a game three up your arsenal would have had this. Except it would have played better. Shadow the Hedgehog and Death Egg Raker. Oh my god! <laughs> they could have gone that route. They made the Shadow the the Ratchet and Clank of the of the Sega franchises. Yeah, they try to make him this like edgy Sonic. He could be just like the uh, the inspector detective character. He just he, needs a he, wide enough array of wacky weapons like Ratchet. Man, oh, man. they really You're miscast scared, Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> they they need Tell to cast me what Shadow I want to know. <laughs> Shadow just slams 
Uh, Shao just slams the suspect's face into the fucking interrogation table. Where are the drugs? Nothing <laughs> more. That would be a Grand Theft Auto attempt. What the fuck is that thing? What the fuck? That's like the hilt of like some devil sword. Looks like a JRPG artifact. It seems they don't. That looks like something Lena Inverse would have. Yeah, it's like it's like light. It's like you know how the had the sword of light. That's the sword of darkness. He puts his fists up as if he's gonna use them. Yeah, he's gonna... Oh, it's new s Egg Cerberus. Wait, we fought this Again. already. Yeah, so y so it should be easy the second time around. Good luck. Yeah, except this one is covered in snow, maybe? <laughs> it's not- it's unclear. Show also, the... gotta love how that cutscene ended with uh, Egg Pawn robots coming to kill you and you fight a Cerberus after that cutscene. Like what? Yeah, because the Cerberus is like, no, this is my jurisdiction. I'm gonna take out Shadow. Sir, don't you think we should put the egg Cerberus model in that cutscene? No, it lags the screen too much. <laughs> put it away. Just, just leave it. Or maybe they were gonna do like some other thing, but then they're like, yeah, we still got we got this boss. Let's just fucking do it again. Go up, Shadow! Shadow, you idiot! Go up. <laughs> Shadow stuck. You know that dog from Metal Gear Revengeance? This is just like the Clifford version of that. Oh yeah, uh, Blade Wolf, I think was the dog's name. The, uh, uh, what the survey said, they called it the dog-shaped robot buddy. I'm, I want I'm Shadow just... to adopt this robot and call it Sparky. <laughs> Ride it into on battle. On one hand, I'm disappointed that we're never going to get a sequel to Revengeance, but on the other hand, I'm just glad that uh, Platinum was able to uh, do near Automata and save himself from bankruptcy. Oh yeah, I need to finish that at some point. I started playing it and then I stopped. I've never played it. I just, I, you know, what's funny about near Automata is that uh, is that I heard about the guy, the director's work. Uh, first, when he, when he uh, did Dragon Guard. Have you ever played Dragon Guard? No. You ever heard of Dragon Guard? No. That game is like, that game is, is kind of the opposite of Sonic. Well, it's kind of like Sonic 06 in that the gameplay, the moment to moment gameplay, is like bad uh, Dynasty Warriors, but the storyline is just so, is bad shit as fuck. <laughs> Just, just find like a a, a, a form of it with just the cutscenes. I, I guess I'm not supposed well. to be doing that. Oh, you're not allowed that. to do it from the front. Oh. You gotta, you gotta go hit up it from tail. the back. You gotta get up on the Hydra's back. Get up on the Hydra's back! Yeah, I, I I knew you would say that. That's why I said it. Um. You know, this doesn't really feel like an egg robot fight because Eggman isn't here shouting, GET A LOAD OF THIS! I can't believe this! Um, but yeah, among among other things, it features a, uh... Oh, God. It's got a lot of... It's got a lot of bad stuff, but one of... The, but, uh, some of the less extreme stuff, I could reasonably say on stream without people, like, uh, getting angry is, uh, you gotta get some rings, man, uh, is, uh, is, like, weird, uh, overtones between the main character. Oh, no! No, no, no. It's, I got some, I got a better one. It's got, the main conceit of the, of the game is that, uh, is that these, there's, like, mythical beasts, right? And apparently, you can make, like, a, a pact with the beast. And if you do, you're linked to him, you get powers, you can talk to the beast, but you lose something in exchange, and the thing you lose is always random. Um, the main character oh. makes a makes a pact with the dragon and ends up losing his ability to talk, and so becomes a silent protagonist. This sounds like Dragalia Lost, but with extra steps. Uh, yeah, and uh. Okay, I give up, Saucy. What am I doing? A lot of trouble. <laughs> yeah, it has registered at least three times. Yeah, that's weird. Am I doing the um, right thing? I know you are, I'm not, that's why I'm No, am I? That's why I'm weird. asking that. Am I still supposed to be riding his tail up? Yeah, yeah. it's the same fight. It's, it's literally I don't remember the, the first fight. 
I have wiped the first stream from my memory. Why? It's a, good, it's a great game. You gotta remember that shit. Um, it's a 7 out of 10. <laughs> so, uh... So, th then there's another character who, uh... Who makes a pact with a couple of fairies and loses his sight. Uh -huh. um, there's another character who, uh, like this elf woman, who makes a pact with a couple of spirits and then, uh, and then the seals. They're all seals, right? One person uh, has sealed their, their tongue, which means he lost their voice. Uh, the other person sealed their eye, which they can't see. Uh, this woman, uh, her, her womb gets sealed. So she can't have kids anymore. Uh, um, so then, uh, then there's, uh, this other kid whose time gets sealed, which means that he can't age anymore. He makes a pact with a golem. That doesn't sound like a loss, that sounds like a win. <laughs> yeah, see, see, uh, and then this is the weirdest one. This guy makes a pact with a petrified dragon, because apparently you can do that. He loses his hair. <laughs> What an idiot. <laughs> I'm gonna make a pact with the statue and possibly lose my soul. Oh shit, my hair. Oh, well, if he gets powers from it, hair is not a bad thing to lose. Who cares if you're yeah. bald if you can, like, manipulate the universe? Yep. Dragalia Lost is weird in that it's kind of a similar thing, but, like, it's a gotcha game. And they had a uh, event where Joker from Persona was in it, but every character has to have a dragon pact, right? Mm hmm So they made Morgana the dragon, and I'm like, that's not a fucking dragon. That's a but... cat. <laughs> just have the cat What just... do you mean? The Why not dra... make Arsene the dragon? You know what? what? Just, just get Morgana, right? And you, and you dress the cat up as like a, in cute dragon pajamas, and there you go, it's a dragon. <laughs> That's what, yeah. that's what I would do. I'm like, it's just like his Sonic a... the Hedgehog outfit. Here's my here's my thing. Uh, it, just do just do more than nothing at all. <laughs> <laughs> do do literally more than nothing. Oh, I'm so salty because on my old phone I had Dragalia Lost, but I didn't link in a Nintendo account because I didn't have a Switch yet. And I spent so much money on getting these rare five-star characters. And I lost all of my data. Because I didn't link my account. I was so mad. Should have linked. This is, yeah, always link your account. Moral of the I story. I didn't have a Switch yet, so I didn't have a Nintendo account. Never spend oh. money on microtransactions for any game ever. Yeah. Except for Magic, because because <laughs> because Magic's that's, been around for years. That's why after I got Gladion and Masters in Pokemon Masters, I was like, I need to link my Nintendo account because I have to move to a different a different device. What is precision machinery? Like watches? <coughs> Even Shadow acknowledges her existence. Why can't Silver do that? Why is he not allowed to acknowledge her? Maybe she maybe he literally can't see her. She's like <laughs> she's That's she's like <laughs> her prison she's under his powers. It's like when that one like god emperor of Dune like read a line specifically so that his prescience couldn't see her. This is this is it that No, like Sonic's friends uh like keep hearing him talk about some princess and they're like, What the fuck are you talking about? This but is a why... republic. <laughs> <laughs> ghost, that would ghost be princess. so funny. Ghost that would be princess. so funny if the ending of this game was like Sonic. Who's Elise? There hasn't been a princess here ever. They they killed the princess. They beheaded her like fucking Marie Antoinette. What are you talking about? She was killed in 1945. <laughs> oh wait, the Nazis got her. <laughs> We need the Majora's Mask Sonic game. The one that's all dark and creepy and ethereal. And there's set double meanings to everything. God, that worked for Legend of Zelda. I feel like <laughs> Sonic, the Sonic series is too happy for that. Yeah. That reminds me... That reminds me of once someone said, like... Someone told you, Jack, that, like, in a Sly Cooper level, that the guards carry around gold bars, and you went, What are they, Nazis? 
and that got such a <laughs> chuckle out of me. <laughs> I, like, yeah, I forgot about that. I guess. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. <laughs> why did... I, I heard you say that. I was like, what, what does that mean? <laughs> I think it was a thing where it was like I, uh, Nazi gold. and I heard I heard uh, that one uh, terrible a uh, director, out. what's his name, Uwe Boll, make a joke about that when uh, in the fucking uh, uh, Postal movie. So yeah. it was, I think it was fresh in my mind. Doesn't Uwe Boll exclusively make movies that are like, Hey look, it's that video game, but a movie, but for like, video games that nobody plays? People played Far Cry, uh, people played House of the Dead. There was a Far Cry movie? But like, it's not, they're yeah, not like, Uwe Boll made like it. nobody asked for those movies. Yeah. These don't seem like movies that would be profitable, no. I will say that. <laughs> that's Gabe. Wait a minute. That's Gabe. Whoa, 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 Back up. Einstein's a character. Wait, now I. Einstein. Ex well, I wanted to read, but you guys keep talking about shit. Wait, <laughs> sorry. I'm chatty. It's all my. Don't worry about it. So Gabe Newell claims to be a mathematician with an IQ higher than Einstein's. Einstein exists in this universe. He does. Why not? The U.S. president does. Yeah. Well, a U.S. president. Oh, it's a quiz. The U.S. exists. Period. <laughs> yep, loading a quiz. I didn't even mean to do this. I wasn't intending to do side missions. Three eight Remember. four, two eight two six eight three. I'm not gonna remember that. I'm just gonna screenshot. <laughs> cool math. What's nine plus ten? Do you feel the blood rushing into your brain? There's more? Yeah. <sighs> you, you didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? What? Well, now how that doesn't she? Six, eight, nine. 4923. I gotta be careful about knocking him into the other ones by accident. Just. I don't know. Thanks, Jack. I, I don't. I'm sorry. Gotta load between every random. Hey, memorize this number, asshole. <laughs> I have an I, I have an IQ higher than Einstein's. Memorize these numbers. You want to do math? Fuck you. Next I think, question. you know who I think this is? I think this is Eggman with a wig and he shaved his mustache. <laughs> no, he took it off. He'll put it back on after. Question. Memorize. <laughs> five, eight, nine, sixty-four, fifty-five. What? No? That was five. I don't care, Mr. Mathematician. Whatever, we can get out of this hellscape. You need to concentrate more. You need to get a better fucking quest. Your questions suck. Imagine Mario Odyssey. Except every time you ask the Sphinx a question, every time it asks you a question, it has to go through a loading screen. That would be annoying. That would be very annoying. Was I... Okay, Fucking where, where am I going? I a... Riddle I me like this. You. How many more loading screens will you have to get through to get out of here? 
So I think the gateway was the way to go. Or is this the way to go? I should have saved before I did that. No, it's fine. You can it's save now. The old castle. Old castle. God. How many more pain meds do I have to take today before it stops? You got a headache? No, I've got tooth pain. Oh. Uh, I've been there. That sucks. Why do dentists always gotta be smart asses about how bad I am at brushing my teeth? I know they're right, but they don't have to be It's literally their job. Their, their job <laughs> is literally, hey, you, you need to brush your teeth. But every time it's just like, man, you suck at this. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. What is that? <laughs> He, he does fucking Kamehameha's! Oh, he could do that this entire time? That's how you break, can break the ice over there. He hip thrusted forward level. into those rings. He's, he's, he's got energy blasts! <laughs> he's full on Vegeta! <laughs> okay, where's the castle? Where am I going? Sure is a whole lot of nothing. You're not a castle. Fuck. No. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> You're free to tell me where to go. I don't care about that. I actually uh, don't remember. Wait, wait there's a bridge now? I, I warped across this and it made a bridge. <laughs> You created one with your hedgehog dick. Remember Dragon Ball when uh, Master Roshi pissed on the moon? <laughs> <laughs> and later in Dragon Ball Z, Piccolo did it. <laughs> There's no that choice! I'm pissed. going to have to piss on the moon! Remember when they I sent that rabbit up there? <laughs> yes, they did send a rabbit to pills. the moon. Just to forget about him and subsequently blow up the moon later. Yeah, they killed I that missed rabbit, my dude. wife, Goku. <laughs> oh god, that hurts. Uh, well, I can't do nothing here because I, I can't swim like Sonic. I have no idea where Wait, you're Wait, Eggman, right you're now. my dad? Yes. Well, that makes uh, the events of the previous game uh, more disturbing. <laughs> Is that from a fan dub? Uh, yeah. And, and so, the, the Sonic Adventure 2 one was the one where Shadow pissed on his fucking wife. Uh, <laughs> and then and then in, the, in the, the Sonic 06 dub, he drops the thing like, Wait, Shadow, you're my dad? Or, wait, Eggman, you're my dad? And he's like, yes! Oh, well, um, oh, I think it's, uh, that means, oh, jeez, I don't want to think about that. And Sonic Heroes or Sonic 06? Sonic 06. I don't think Sonic Heroes had a... He doesn't really have enough cutscenes compared to the adventures in this game. <laughs> Their RE2 fan dub makes me pee myself laughing. It has no right to be as funny as it is. Is this the old castle? This doesn't Maybe. appear. Actually, I feel like this must be the right place. Well, I but got I there's don't money. Think I think you're supposed to be on top of this. What? How? I don't know. Lady, or person, can you get me up? You want to know what I'm doing? There's only one thing an archaeologist like myself would do. I'm researching. Jeez. Useless. I love how, how Shadow is perfectly at, at ass level. <laughs> like, 
stare directly. He can punch you in the dick there. very easily. <laughs> What's that? I'm gonna what hit was you that with the dick. I'm gonna hit you with the dick. <laughs> what was that height comparison meme I saw? Where it was like a bunch of Zelda characters lined up and someone pointed out that Link could suck Ganondorf's dick without having to bend down. You're right, but please <laughs> shut up. He was so gross. <laughs> <laughs> to, be, to be fair, I think everybody in Hyrule can suck the other stick without having to bend down, get on their knees. So, because he's tall, he's a tall motherfucker. Except the other Gerudo. Apparently, there's a female tall motherfucker in Breath of the Wild. Oh so, yeah. I realized lately that I have a thing for like. The motif of a couple who, where one of them is absurdly tall and the other is absurdly short. I don't know why. I wanted to go play, but now I can't. That sucks, blonde Harry Potter. Oh, okay, right. You're supposed to be here. Be doing this. <laughs> Good call. That is blonde Harry Potter. When the chaos gauge is full, well, I don't know. Do I have enough chaos? Yes. Okay, how do you? <laughs> Right, no. It's not working! Oh, <laughs> ah! Now fuck rolling, I wanna glitch through. I got the camera through. Try doing what you did again. Just her. Yeah. Maybe your gauge wasn't full enough. I see three uh three uh -oh. little bars. So. Okay, I got I got out. I don't. <laughs> okay. I don't know if you notice it. Use R1 to do know. a chaos boost. Bubble over there. If that doesn't tell me how to use it, though. You you pick it up. <laughs> so I press R1 and then what? Now what? And then hit hit hit, hit it again, maybe. Nothing's uh, happening with R1 do a again. Do homing attack. Homing attack, maybe. No. Oh. Yeah, homie. Yeah. There you go. yeah, I was right. Wait, how am I out here? How are you here? You went you went into the fucking portal. I should have saved. Whoops. You can always <laughs> you can always leave, right? Yeah. You can always just give up and then get out of there. Does does it take you right back to where you were before you jumped in though? Probably well, not. I mean it's either that or you lose a bunch of progress. I, I think I saved in that jungle area. It was just when I entered it, so I'd have to do the cave again. Ooh! We really are um, Jack, too. I'm gonna kill Baron Eggman! This is so cool. <laughs> I remember seeing a Shadow of the Hedgehog trailer on TV once. And it showed Shadow riding on a dragon's back, and I was like, holy shit, that's cool! He doesn't ride a dragon's back, it's Shadow by a child. I, I know it's not a cut. dragon, it's like some kind of fucking alien. What happened? What happened? I, you I, died. I guess I won? You, you, you hit the wall, and then Yay! you died. Are you sure? It didn't look like I hit a wall. We'll find out after it's done loading. Any minute now. <laughs> I'm like legit. This really start is taking playing a while. Elevator music. Oh, no. okay. You uh, you you got through. I'm glad to be wrong. Shadow of the Black Knight. <laughs> May I, they don't even have the Level. decency of giving me a radar in this one. Yeah, you don't have a radar. This level is so ugly. God. 
looks nice. It's got a castle aesthetic. Man, remember when she was cool and kicked stuff? Now she's got to throw bombs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she's got bombs. She Didn't stole she have a spinning drill like kick in the anime? She had that yep. in Sonic Adventure 2. Where they just appear? <laughs> Looks like they're they're equipped with heavy weapons. Oh no, if only I could aim my arms anywhere but one direction. I'll have to approach it the same way I approach every other enemy. Throw a bomb at it. <laughs> I guess I should be killing things in case, like, a key is inside a robot or something. I don't remember where you're supposed to find the keys, actually. Hello. No, okay, they're just objects floating around. <coughs> well, I need to get in there somehow. Smack. Oh, I can place time bombs. How big an area do they cover? Not very. Uh, looks like they would cover more, but... I also can't glide into people like I could in previous Sonic games. Switch above here, I can activate. This looks like Twilight Princess. It actually, kind of does. Yeah. Which is a console that. older, so that's not great. God, this level is huge. We figure this be our last one. Yeah, that was an unnecessary flip. It's so unsatisfying compared to going up and kicking the shit out of something. Ow. Why are they just there? The physics engine is just so fucked. <laughs> oh, wait. If I hold it... I can- I enter first person and I control where I aim. That's what's happening. I think we could see inside her face. I see her eyelashes. Because <laughs> guess what? This game's not- This game has some, like, mild issues wrong with it. It's 7 out of 10. It'd be 10 out of 10 if they ironed out all the issues. Yeah. The mild the issues, you said. <laughs> Bruce. Oh, uh, free! <laughs> So she cannot climb this surface, she cannot grab this surface, and she can do that on that surface. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, I want someone to T-pose so bad. <laughs> we got a lot of that in Tony Hawk. Uh oh! What I do? Whoa! 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 What just happened? Oh, you destroyed the base. I guess that's somehow. realistic. You throw bombs everywhere, something's gonna break. What's he doing? Is he resting? Is he tired? I guess so. He's laying on his side. He ain't tired anymore. Uh, it's just too heavy. So these are... Are these gun robots? There's not, like, small critters in them. 
No, I think they're Eggman robots. He's just I he's not doing I don't that think anymore. Eggman's, I think Eggman stopped putting small critters in his robots. He realized like, that was impractical all the time. Because he's able, he's like, wait, I can just use AI instead of animal, animal uh, brains. But then we're at the point where he's not really doing anything wrong other than trying to get the Chaos Emeralds, to be hey, honest. He, <laughs> he's trying to get the Chaos Emeralds. He wants to rule the world. He doesn't want to be, like, he's authoritarian. He's not a monster, is what, is what I'm... He's I, a communist. <laughs> the camera keeps rotating 180 degrees, and I have zero idea why. I'm not doing that. <laughs> So we found one of the three keys, and we have no idea how to open the way to it. Ah, oh, yeah. No. Nope. So, oh. she just can't go That's up not good. like you sloping can it, surfaces. Maybe. She can't go up these uh, slope surfaces. Unlike Knuckles in Sonic Adventure, who had no issue with such slope surfaces. No, it's, the architecture here is uh, is designed to be that like that. So I don't know if it was just me, but like even as a kid in Sonic Adventure, I did everything I could to get to the top of the the shrine in Mystic Ruins. I don't know why I wanted to get up there so bad. Because the, there might be something cool up there. You oh might no. find Mew. I just realized something. You know what? who else is uh, is streaming on YouTube right now? Oh. Our competition. Oh, Our competition, oh. at least uh, from my subscription, is uh, Amelia Watson from Hollow Live. She's apparently watching <laughs> Spider Man and my like Spider Man. She's watching she... two Spider Mans. Okay. Which Spider Mans? Hold on. What is she, your fucking rival? Oh, you have to defeat all the enemies to get the lasers to go away. Oh. So I gotta figure out how to get rid of those spider wall things. That wasn't oh, she's even a key. Spider Man into the Spider Verse. Okay. Oh, that's a good movie. Yeah. Well, I saw that also... on. Uh, I first saw it when I uh, got home from graduation. Oh, she also, she also watched. Uh, she also watched the 2002 Spider Man, which is the best Spider live action Spider Man before Marvel was like, hey, let's make, let's do Spider Man, Sony. And Martin and Sony was like, okay, fine. Okay. You want, you want to do Spider-Man? Okay. Our, uh, our amazing Spider-Man stuff didn't do so well. And, uh, and our Fantastic Four stuff is uh, garbage. Um, I thought people liked Amazing Spider-Man. You what? Hey guys, remember how when in Spider-Man 3 we crammed as many story beats in as possible and everyone hated it? Let's do that again! Maybe they'll like it this time! Oh, they didn't like it this time? Okay, well, I'll do it. I'll do it again. We'll do it again. <laughs> I remember when uh, it came out that Sony and Disney might have to, like, part ways, and that Spider-Man would be taken out of Marvel. I remember seeing a tweet that was like, And thus it was so, every third Spider-Man movie was cursed. <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> the original Spider-Man 3 did poorly and the director said a curse was like, there will be Amazing no Spider-Man 3 three. was cancelled <laughs> Amazing Spider-Man 3 was cancelled because I'm surprised that they made a sequel after Amazing Spider-Man I, I didn't think people were like talking about Amazing Spider-Man all that well I'm surprised I wonder, they did it I'm I like, wonder if there's gonna another... be another uh, schedule that'll come out for the next set of Marvel movies and DC movies like it did before in like 2016. Didn't they already have like they're like, hey, Black Widow, we'll uh, we're doing we're doing Black Widow. Yeah, but I mean like there was like a thing that came out that was like a schedule of like everything going up to like 2022 or something. Whereas like here here's all the Spider-Man movies that are come out gonna come out. And Amazing Spider-Man 3 was on the list before it got canceled. I just realized something. Yeah? What? What are we supposed to do here? We're supposed to get keys, Collect which... keys! <laughs> I got oh. one? Oh, this is... This is this is that Sonic Adventure 2, the... Uh, like, no, minigame, but terribly. No, this it, is Sonic Adventure 2, but terrible. Yeah, because we don't have any kind of radar. Yeah, you have to guess where it is. 
Well, what's this? I no, think there no, might be that. one in the in the building in the middle, but I'm not sure. This looks blow upable. What's this that? is a good idea. Nope. <laughs> what's the building in the middle? Like there's some kind of cathedral somewhere on, on the map. What map? This map. <laughs> I, I don't mean a mini map on screen, I mean this level. So, uh, Saucy, what, what is your opinion, opinion of the whole, uh, like, rising trend of uh, VTubers? I don't really watch them, so I don't particularly care about them. Oh, uh, well. Because I don't, you know, I don't simp over people who aren't real. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, they're more just kidding. They're just technically kidding, more liar. real than they're technically more real than fucking uh, like drawn cartoons. So I will it's... say though that my dad Hello? had has. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my god, my dad has been planning on becoming a VTuber with a voice modulator, and also all I can say is you guys better be careful because you might be simping for a, for someone who's not actually a girl. Fine, personality. Like if they, if people can simp uh, however they want to simp. Their lives. Um, Live a lie. <laughs> I, I, was, I was about to say. Uh, at yeah, the very it's least. At the very least. Uh, oh, bomb on the. No. Destroy this okay. fine so yeah. glass. That was. The bomb is still there. Your surroundings. <laughs> Fuck. So, uh, so I was about to say, uh, Amelia does, uh, watches of movies, as I mentioned earlier. I, and she, somebody did the highlights of her watching The Witch, and she oh, saw boy. the dog die, and she's like, why? Yeah. And then she watched Hereditary, <laughs> which if you've never watched oh, Hereditary. Hereditary is so good. <laughs> that dinner so scene is awesome. <laughs> Oh, the, after the, after, uh, what the? Is that a hover bike? It is a hover yeah. vehicle. That's so cool. Are you gonna shoot? Oh, it's got, it's got machine guns. They shoot! Oh, they, so they. Who is, so who's shot? <laughs> so I'm gonna recommend you don't do that. <laughs> So my question is, who shadows Q? Who's giving him all these gadgets and shit? Eggman? Well, no, it no, can't but... be, because he's working on the government. I don't think you should shoot them, because I think they're the ones who are uh, who are bringing down the pillars. No, well, isn't I that a good reason to shoot thing. them? They come down no matter what you do. Yeah, just, just keep moving. Don't slow down. No breaks. Yeah, it's scripted. That's what I did the first time, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> I just laugh every time they fucking drop a pillar on you. It's just, it's just so funny. Just so, <laughs> so I can outspeed the first two. Put cartoon sound effects over that shit. <laughs> Shadow, why did you do that? I knew it would fall. That one didn't fall. Okay, you can cast it. Good. So now, uh. Uh, oh, I want that, that checkpoint, <laughs> though. No! <laughs> well! That's that's not a good idea. <laughs> Alright, I, I guess we're locked in. Don't Is that die. a bionicle? What was it? The checkpoints <laughs> make it too easy! <laughs> like. The Bionicle. I haven't heard that movie in a long time. I didn't actually watch the movie, but I remember seeing a trailer for it on one of the DVDs that I had at the time. Yeah, so did I. What was it like? It was robots and they were trying to save, save the world or whatever. Every company had an edgy phase in the mid 2000s. Bionicle was Legos. Mid 2000s was like 
like 90s was like, you wanna get extreme? And then 2000s was like, we're gonna get really fucking extreme. You don't know, man. You're gonna get so extreme. No, okay. Where I am I going? 90s was like, you wanna get extreme? And then uh, 2000s was like, you wanna get hardcore. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going wait, or what I'm wait, doing. Wait. I think there's an eagle over there. There is an eagle. Do I ride the fucking eagle? Ride the eagle. Yeah! America! <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this game? <laughs> what the fuck you got over that? It says America! <laughs> <laughs> It's like, it's like that, that Photoshop edit of Trump taking a selfie with Shadow the Hedgehog. See, you see, this is, this is why everybody still plays this game. This is why this game still has a fucking, a fucking community around it. Because this game is insane. <laughs> America. <laughs> I'd like to go to a stopping what point, but I don't know what a stopping point is! <laughs> oh no, you're killing Saucy. <laughs> Fuck. Saucy, please don't die. I'm fine. Don't even laugh at my jokes. <laughs> There's wind? Why is there wind? <laughs> By the way, they're just destroying a bunch of like historical landmarks. Princess, uh, Princess with uh, Elise would, will be like, like who's gonna pay for all this? <laughs> she walks and she's like, "What the fuck are you guys doing? This is sacred land." <laughs> and the shadows like there are robots here. They had to be destroyed. It's just the DC method. Property destruction no. doesn't matter. It's a it's, she's like, there's a, man, I work for Gun. I think. What is Gun? Is Gun like CIA? So America is America's government is just dawdling around destroying other countries' property. Sounds about right. Yeah. Like, what is Gun <laughs> supposed to be? Are they like a PMC? Are they like? They're just uh, military. That's all they are. So they're military. They are they so? They took CI the CIA the army. I guess if you want to call them, uh, make sh uh, if you want to call them pseudo FBI CIA, you can. Uh, they're, but they're full of soldiers. Like they call them soldiers. They're not they're specifically military. the United States military. They're just a vague military. But they work for the United States president. <laughs> maybe they're like, uh, maybe they're like the Gundam Wing equivalent, where there's just this PMC that. All the nations call on when another nation's being mean to them. Oh, Z Xenon? This is actually nerve wracking right Shadow now because you're on your last life. If Shadow I the Hedgehog gets offended when he sees someone wearing a fake uh, army medal. <laughs> Stolen that word. Glory seeking motherfucker. <laughs> God, do you, think, do you think Shadow was active in this universe as Iraq? <laughs> <laughs> he was like going around using his chaos powers to detonate landmines and shit. The idea of Sonic characters getting involved in real world shit that America is involved in. God. <laughs> Man, like, he was designed as a I military won't. weapon, but if people used him that way, but the other countries would get mad. <laughs> no, oh, okay, there we go. well... The end. GG. <laughs> how far... I'm gonna check how far back we were is all, before we stop. Uh, oh, uh, probably the beginning of this level. Soliana Forest? Oh, yeah. Last sa D yep. save point? This is, this is a long level. I'm depressed. <laughs> That's gonna. Oh, we gotta find all the fucking keys again. Yep. <laughs> They're in the same place. Don't worry. I know they are, but that's gonna be like two months from now. I'm not gonna remember shit. 
<laughs> I'll jog your memory. <laughs> I like these streams. The Sonic 06 stuff is some of the fu most fun I've ever had. Probably because I've got <laughs> a giggly person just laughing at all my all my dumb shit. Are you off tomorrow, Jack? <laughs> oh. Are you off tomorrow, Jack? Yeah, I am. I, I'm. Off. I have the next two days off. Okay, we'll probably be able to stream something in there then. Cool. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Yep. Thanks for joining time. me, guys. See you, everybody. We'll see you next time.